Hey, what's up, everyone? Welcome to the Flying Fluffy Hockey live stream of the Florida Panthers and Columbus Blue Jackets game. So, right after getting to play the Senators again, the Panthers get to play Columbus. So, that's pretty nice. And also the Red Wings and Penguins are playing tonight. So that's going to be a massive, a, a game with massive implications on the playoff race. <sighs> Hello, Daniel, what's up? How you? How is everyone doing tonight? Hey, Jameson. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, I really enjoyed making the video. For those of you who don't know what I'm talking about, I'll, I'll, I'll mention it in a few minutes once some more people come in. So, um, from Ryan. That's also this is also yes. from Ryan yeah. Roy. Yeah. So Ryan Roy had previously sent us. A an authentic Sean Bergenheim helmet, and he apparently has sent something else yeah, as that, well. That one's for you. Yeah, this this is what this is what he had sent yesterday. This oh, is what. Yeah. yeah, that's the helmet that he. This sent. is the sh authentic sh game worn Sean Bergenheim helmet, signed by Bergenheim as well. That um, Ryan Roy sent us. So, and then we've got another package here that's also something that he sent us. So, Which, by the way, those of you who won stuff from JC, I'm going to be giving that stuff out to you next week. Okay. So this is this is pretty awesome. Also, um, available for sale in the eBay store. It's going to be three thousand ah! dollars. This is Kyle's script that he wrote for himself for the video he put out today he's gonna sign it and date it three grand obo nice try put it in auction <laughs> why you undersell yourself huh has the video reached a million views yet no no <laughs> fine i'll put it in auction but i'm making the starting price fifteen hundred dollars <laughs> Open, open, open the package because I got to do a couple things. Yeah. Okay. So this is from Ryan Roy. It appears to be a jersey of some kind. So let's see what he got us. There's like two layers of plastic. Okay. It is a. Um. Let's see. Let me take. I'm just, I'm just seeing it's, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's look at that's the real deal, bro. Official. Let's see. Give me a minute, okay? Show the crowd what you've won. Oh my god! <laughs> it's a Barkov jersey. Yeah. Hell look yeah! That. It's got the C on it and everything. Huh? Thank you, Ryan. Now wait a minute. Oh, oh, oh my God! There's no some, way. There's something wrong with no this way. NHL logo. Oh no way! It says L N H. The logo's on upside down. No, it's in a completely wrong order. Oh my God! It's L N H instead of N H L. Oh my God! That's hysterical. And is there supposed to be two captain patches? I'm not sure about that. This I is that what the, I don't know. This is what the there's oh, two captain patches here. But they spelled bark off, right? Right. That's that's the other patch. Right. Oh, it's the French shield. Oh, okay. Oh. So I got the uh, fancy French version. Very cool. Okay. They did spell Barkov correctly. Right. 
This is not fanatics. It's a it's Adidas. Okay. Which is weird because the package says it came from fanatics, <laughs> but it's it's the authentic it's that the authentic awesome. Barkov jersey. Here, I'll try I'll try this on. Okay, go ahead. Let's see. I got it. Watch your feet. <clears throat> okay. We got Seth Mether Messer Smith saying go jackets. Okay. Hey, got a nice dash to have a jackets fan. Very cool. Yeah. Yeah, Fanatics has the Adidas jerseys, right? Yeah, exactly, Jameson. He's now got two Frankenstein monster panther jerseys. No, that is very that is cool. That is cool. You can you can have a trivia contest. Look at my jersey and tell me what's wrong and see how long it takes somebody to figure it out. You good? Yeah. 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 It fits. Yeah. Here I'll show it all. Yeah, there you go. There you go. There you go. No. This is not being broken out until playoff time. Right. And usually I would wear my Jaws Jr. jersey. Yeah, well, we got we've got a jersey and a bat. We we got you know, in case they lose a game, you could switch jerseys. Yeah. You start with one, and if they lose a game, you switch. This is pretty awesome. That is thank awesome. You, thank Ryan, you, Ryan. Ryan and Roy, thank you so much. I'm going to go hang this up in my closet. Okay, all right, but come on right back because I got it. I still I'm not done with my work, but I'll sit down for you. Yeah. Good point. All right. I'm going to take over the stream. <laughs> I still got to do my pregame. Hurry up, Kyle. I just remembered. I still got to do my pregame. So is it is it is it true that Bob is in net tonight, or is that just a troll job so that when I go do my pregame, I, I do a whole thing, and then it's wrong again? Hey, Daniel. On Pozo Hattie, you're calling it? <laughs> Uh, Simon wants to know if I if we've been keeping up with the Coyotes relocation rumors. Um, I've I've seen it, but I had not had a chance to really watch a lot of content or read anything too much about it. Um, uh, Kyle's video that was that was a solid three hours work this morning. <laughs> he wrote the whole thing. He did it all. I edited it, so it's a lot easier to edit. When it comes from your head, because you, you know you know what goes where. Uh, with Kyle, he had to wrote he had to write me a whole big long list of stuff. Hey Roger, hello from Wallace, Nova Scotia. Thank you for joining us. Hey Dave, thank you, David. Yeah, yeah, he uh he did he did pretty good for his first his first one by himself. You know he what's funny. Is you know I see when I'm watching all of his takes, he he gets the same frustrations as I do. So a lot of the times when he screws up, he'll say the same thing. He'll he'll have the exact same mannerisms. So I was I was laughing because it was like watching myself. Sybil says, "Sir Riley Freeman have reported that the move to Salt Lake City is basically a done deal." Ish. Oh. That can't make some people happy. Okay, you good? Yeah. Okay, yeah, here's the star of the show. Wow. I forgot I gotta do the video. Yeah, you I'm did forget. A, you do the videos now. I'm, I'm just, I'm just JC, you enjoyed the skit video today. That's awesome. Let's see. David says that video came out very well. You guys did a great job. Thank you. Let's see. Daniel. Daniel is calling for an Ocposo Hattie. So, how is everyone doing tonight? Oh. 
Silva. Silva says part of the rumored Coyotes to Salt Lake City deal is apparently an exclusive five-year window to bring an expansion franchise to Phoenix if the arena is built. They're not going to build a. They're not going to build a, an arena for a team that doesn't exist. They won't build an arena for the team they got. Yeah. David asks, "Are we winning by six goals tonight, or just five? So, so <laughs> I wouldn't. Uh, Get that overconfidence, David. You know, we still have to play the game. What's up, Jeffrey? Yeah, I heard that the Coyotes were bidding on some land in North Scottsdale. I also heard that the mayor of Scottsdale was not going to support it in any fashion. But the feat is... That the land that they're bidding on isn't even part of Scottsdale. It's part of it's part of uh, Glendale, I believe. What's up, Jeffrey? Hello, Raven. Well, it's great to have you all here, and we can definitely. I have to imagine it will be a, maybe not a blowout victory, but, you know, we're not the Flyers. It should not be losing to the Columbus Blue Jackets. We would have to put up an effort in the negative for us to, to lose to the Blue Jackets. Hello, Andrew. Jeffrey says that Leafs fans think that the Leafs are better than last year. What do I think? Uh, it's going to be it's going to be interesting to see because they basically they they got rid of Kyle Dubas and let him go cook in Pittsburgh. So. Yeah, the Bolts, the Bolts play the Sens. The Bolts play the Sens. And tonight the Red Wings play the Penguins. And you better believe I'm covering that game. I'm going to be watching that game during the intermissions of this game. So... I'm sure most of you who have joined us tonight have probably watched the skit video that I made that, that was published on, on the Flying Fluffy channel earlier today. So this NHL Eastern Conference playoff race has been insane. And I wrote an entire sketch based on this playoff race with starting around about late late March, like the third week of March, and continuing until the very present, I had been debating whether or not I should pull up the video and show a, a live presentation on it here on this live stream before the game starts. I'll, I'll only do that if there are enough people here who haven't seen the video and who want to see it without having to click off to go to watch the video. <laughs> Raven, Raven says, I look great in the Bruins gear. Domi has been getting assists, but Jeffrey, you think that Florida will shut Toronto down physically on the boards? Am I going to do one for the West? Only, only if the Golden Knights blow that last playoff spot because the rest of the West has basically either clinched or eliminated at this point. Let's see. Andrew, glad you thought the lightning bit was funny. 
Let's see. <laughs> so, yeah, let me... Let me... Let me go over real quick, figure out how to... How to do this. Let's see. Your channel, your videos. Okay. All right. Give me one second, folks. I, I'll share this uh, video. Let's see. Okay, here we go. Share screen, yada yada. Okay, give me a second. All right. I believe I believe you'd be a you'll be able to hear the audio. You'll be able to hear the audio. This is this is me. I wrote this. Um, Jaws did all the editing, but here I hope you I hope you guys enjoy it. Let's see. Well, we're still third place in the metro in spite of our goaltending situation. How bad is this division? It's great to be in a wall of card spot. About time the Easter plan finally bore fruit. Mm. All the other teams in the East are tripping over themselves. Who's going to take our spot? Surprise! Awesome. I'm back! What? How? Ovi started scoring again, so that means we're back in the playoff picture. <laughs> now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going to take third place in the Metro. Oh, no, you don't. We have come too far to give up third place in the Metro to Ovi and the retirement home. Him. Oh, yes, we will. No, you. Uh, flyers. Wait a minute. They're choking. We're back in the playoffs, baby. Uh, are you okay? Uh, we're just gonna take third place in the metro. It's okay. Thanks. Where did they come from? Wait a minute. If you lost, and we lost, and the Flyers lost, then that means. Glad you're enjoying it, Dave. Oh no. No, 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 N not them. The bullshit is real. Sidney Crosby has got Silver Scion. He will not go gently into that good night. He will show no mercy. He will not sleep until the Pittsburgh Penguins have gone back to done. the Stanley Cup. Woo! Woo! Hey, let us in. Yeah, we're still alive out here. Let us in. Okay, that's enough. <laughs> we're taking back the wild card spot. No, we're taking back that wild card spot. Oh, come on! Oh my god, this playoff race is hysterical! <laughs> I know, right? These teams are so awful. See you in the second round, Rangers. Hey, screw you both. You guys get the easy opponents in the first round. I have to play him. Oh, shall love me and despair. It's time to us near. Time for revenge. Revenge against those nasty panthers. Yes. And then the precious, the precious one we are. No one will stop us after we defeat the panthers. 
Yes, yes, the precious will be ours. <laughs> call it, call it. <laughs> Oh, a nice try, Ottawa. Hello. Line 14. Let's give this one last go. The bullshit is real! Sandy <laughs> Crosby has gone super scion. He will not rest. He, he will show some, no mercy. He, he will not sleep That's until the Pittsburgh right Penguins go to the Stanley Cup. Woo! Woo! No bullshit is real. I so many Penguins got to Stanley Cup. He will not go gently into that good night. He will show no mercy. He will not sleep until the Pittsburgh Penguins are back in the Stanley Cup. Woo! <laughs> yeah, it's so always, so always <laughs> but Bob's in. Okay, let me try this one last time. Line 14. The yids are line. The bullshit is real! Sidney Crosby has gone super scion! He will not go quietly into that good night! He will know... Darn it, it was going so well. Okay. Line 14. The bullshit is real! Sandy Crosby has gone super scion! He will not go gently into that good night. He will show no mercy. He will not sleep until the Pittsburgh Quinn Pink. God damn it. <laughs> Hello. Alright. So in case you joined in case you joined the stream in the middle of that video and wondering what the hell was going on um earlier today on flying fluffy hockey a video titled nhl eastern conference playoff race madness was published and that is a video that i made i I wrote the entirety of it to cover all the madness that has happened in the NHL Eastern Conference playoff picture since about late March. You're talking about the past, like, three weeks. Glad glad you enjoyed it, Raven and, and Dave. Everyone seems to enjoy the... Uh, how I portrayed the Leafs in the video. My personal favorite parts were uh, the Flyers choking and uh, Vazzy. Am I worried about? Am I worried about the Panthers versus the Maple Leafs? Uh, I'll only be worried if the uh, team. If the Panthers play with as little effort as they have played in some of the games in the past couple weeks. <laughs> That's awesome, David. <laughs> both both Daves, thank you for thank you for the compliments on the video. Yeah, like I said, it depends on which Panthers team shows up. So yeah, right now the Capitals are back in the second wild card spot, and the Islanders still somehow have third place in the Metro. Yeah, Austin. Uh, yeah, the Islanders one is hilarious because literally they just walk in on the Flyers completely choking and they're like, uh, are you okay? Glad, glad you enjoyed it, Austin. <laughs> Who gets the last two spots in the East? Uh, definitely not the Flyers. The Flyers went from third place in the Metro being all but guaranteed to 
Now Fair behinds the Capitals, Penguins, and Red Wings in the playoff race. That is uh, not good. If I had to pick, if I had to pick who gets the last two wild card spots, I am thinking that maybe, maybe the Red Wings, well, the Red Wings, the Red Wings play the Penguins tonight. I was going to say Red Wings and Penguins, but I think if they're playing each other, it might not be possible. I don't know if the Islanders can hang on to third place in the Metro. Penguins might bullshit their way into that spot, or Washington might bullshit their way into that spot. As for the second wild card, I have a feeling Detroit is going to end up with it in the end. Yeah, the Flyers haven't been the same since they played us. It just completely fell off the wheels. Hamburger Hut. Hamburger Hut. Cyborg oh, feeds the Red Wings will lose tonight. Ah, you, you figured me out, man. <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, right, right. As I was walking by, and I was gonna flick your head <laughs> off. You just, you, you, you didn't even know it. It was, uh, yeah, subconscious. <laughs> Call it. I'm not sure if that that is correct, but it sounds sounds right. So, I'll take a look at the standings. All right. So, right now. The Lightning pretty much are secure in the first wall card spot. Bruins, Panthers, Leafs, Rangers, and Hurricanes. I don't foresee those positions changing. Third in the Metro currently belongs to the Islanders with 87 points, 27 regulation wins, and 78 games played. In the second wild card spot, you have the Capitals, who have 85 points, 29 regulation wins, and the same amount of games played as the Islanders. And then right behind them are the Penguins with 84 points, 31 regulation wins, and 78 games played. The Detroit Red Wings are also at 84 points, but they do not have tiebreaker against the Penguins or the Capitals. And they have also played 78 games. And then finally you have the Flyers, who have who are at 83 points. 83 points with 28 regulation wins. And 79 games played, which means all the other thirds in the Metro and wild card hopefuls have a game in hand on on Philly. It's, it's not looking good for Philly. Hey, Eyes and Knights, thank you for the 555. Says, tell Jaws to take the night off. Kyle is running the show. No, okay. I'm not letting you off the hook. Okay. I'm going fishing. The sun is setting in less than an hour. I can go wait fish for an hour and fix that. Big carp out there. <laughs> okay. So. Thank you. Thank you, George. 
who was the dark horse team in each conference? Well, my dark horse team is for the East has got to be the Lightning. They look primed to do what they did in almost every other year for the past few years, and that's go on a tear through the playoffs. And as for B West, I think people might be overlooking Nashville. I mean, they were white hot, but they kind of cooled off. But but Nashville might pull a few upsets. Hello, hockey from home. Isonite says if the Red Wings make it, they are the dark horse. Yeah. Sure, why not? So. Okay, let me get you more water, I guess. Thank you. I'm going to sit my butt in the seat here. Okay. Okay. Oh, well, wait. That's why right. Eyes gave me the night off. No. He paid me to take the night off. I have to. <laughs> God dang, Kyle. You have to at least sit in this chair. All right. Can I go to sleep, though? Yes. <laughs> Eisenhower says, "Report: Maple Leafs ownership could make massive changes if really disappointing first round exit happens again." So tonight's games include. The Devils and Maple Leafs, Washington and Buffalo, Ottawa, Tampa Bay, Philly, and the Rangers, which if the Flyers lose that game, that's pretty much the death knell for their season. Detroit and Pittsburgh, which I am going to be turning on during yeah, the intermissions. The one shame about this game is that we can't watch, we can't watch Detroit and Pittsburgh. Well, technically we could split screen it, but... Yeah. The Islanders play the Canadians. Winnipeg plays Dallas. I, isn't that like a potential playoff preview? And then an utterly uh, meaningless game between San Jose and Seattle. And there's also a Calgary versus Los Angeles game, which should help the Kings. Hey, there you go. Okay. Over and just about. Do it. Do the thing. Okay. Uh, Uncle Gene loved the video. He texted me. He saw the video? Yeah, yeah. What did you say? He said. Why? Sports Short says, Why is Bob playing? He said, Holy crap, that was funny and brilliant. <laughs> I told him you wrote the whole thing. That's awesome. Um, I think the the answer that you would get is that Bob uh, Columbus is Bob's former team. He always plays against Columbus, so maybe I would. Oh yeah, that I forgot would be the last that. night that we have him in that, and let Stolars <laughs> play last the last two, which that would give what's today. Today's the 11th, so that would get Bob like eight days off before the playoffs. What that? Hang on a second. I have to. I have to take a look at something right now because MJ, MJ said something. Uh, oh. What? <laughs> Let's see. Oh, turn that. Tom Brady apparently said he's not opposed. To coming back to the NFL. Oh, the hell. <laughs> okay, MJ, thank you for thank the you, 20. MJ, thank you, thank you, thank you, MJ. Says, thank you, brother. Hey, Jaws and Kyle, happy Thursday. Happy Thursday. OJ Simpson passed OJ away. OJ Simpson died, yep. yeah. Everybody's talking. Tom, that's what MJ said. Tom Brady's coming back to the NFL. You have to word that differently. 
he all, all he said was he's, he was not opposed. He's practically uh, teasing all the Patriots fans. Scott Boras got dropped by Jordan Montgomery. Let's get two over the Jackets. Hey. Thank you, MJ. Thank you again, brother. And John gave us five. Thank you, John. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you John. Thank you, brother. Says, trivia question, when the hell is Luster Ryan going to ever score a goal? Uh, <laughs> yeah, so that's, I, that's a good question. Jeez, there's a lot of empty seats. <laughs> You can't imagine why. Hold on, Bobby, okay? Let me finish my yogurt. I'll yeah. give you more bread, okay? What's the sh <laughs> What's the shirts that they're giving away? Because you can see all the empty seats. They got the shirts on the backs of the empty seats. Hey, John, John Stella gave, thank you for the five, Hamburger Hut. Hey, thank you, John, Hamburger Hut. Thank you, buddy. It's John's fault, yes. Yeah, well, um... I shave it. I would kind of look like Paul Maurice. Yeah. Right, Kyle? I thought yours was patchier I mean, than that. Mine's patchier, but if I grew it long enough, maybe I probably have more up front and less on the top. You said you would look like Terrence Stamp from the Haunted yeah, Mansion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. That, especially if I grew it long. No, that's that's exactly who I would look like. Yeah. What's up, Dennis? If uh oh, uh oh. A great defensive play by Bennett. Gotta get my dad going here. It's if Boston loses a couple of more games, Panthers could win no. Atlantic. No, not interested. <laughs> hey, hey, we scored. Hey, Where's the bell? What Where about? is your bell? What a bell! Shut it! I was just texting my dad, puck, and now I gotta say goal. <laughs> Dang, he abused that goaltender. That's what he did. He abused that poor kid. All right, buddy, you're a good player. I'll get you. So back. that was Matthew Kachuk's 26 goal. It took just over three quarters of a minute to score. Jeez, I could have just not sat down again and we would have scored. All this. There you go, buddy. Okay, you get two pieces for Chucky. Yeah. All right. Put my bell back. That was a good start to the game. Hmm. He's shaved again. He's must not, he must be like getting himself nice and irritated. Hey, MJ, thank you for the two. Thank you, MJ. Thank you, thank you, thank you, buddy. Let's go, Ch Kachuk. We score first, yeah. <laughs> OEL and Cousins got the assists. Interesting. Interesting. Leaf Stevels are tied in one 40 seconds in. Oh my god, that's funny. Okay, that was our first shot of the game, too. <laughs> that goalie didn't even save a shot. That's he. We obliterated him faster than the uh, Ottawa goalie. Okay, so there's a lot of empty seats. If you are those T-shirts in the back of the seats or towels, question mark. Yeah, and I wonder why there's so many empty seats. Talk to Ted Scott me a little bit there, but I think you know what I'm saying. Panther. Oh, Stedlin has it. Oh, and he oh. nearly got the another goal. Can they get two goals before I finish my yogurt? Eisen I says Panthers legend Eric Hollis scored for the Devils. Hey, we got a lot for that Trotrek trade. And when you think about the players Look. that we have and the guys that left, yeah, Hollow, Wenberg, Oosterinen. Hey, Chucky, thank you for the five. This hey, is Chucky, thank five you, for Chucky. Chucky. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Chucky. Thank you. thank you. I shaved just for this day. MG thinks it's a school night. That's why there's empty seats, and it's yeah, it's not even the playoffs. Yeah, yet. no, I, I was, I was, I was being sarcastic. Yeah. 
because that's just kind of the mood I'm in. Bolvar says playoffs begin next week. I'm not ready, Vegas. Please don't get. I think, but I think uh, talk to text got you, Bolvar. I can't make sense of your uh, the second half of your sentence. Don't get swept, Dak, and make the playoffs. Maybe he's asking them to not get overtaken by the Blues. I think that's what he's trying to say. Austin asks, does Jaws like the playoff format, or does he wish it was 1v8? No, I'm fine with things the way they are. I'm old enough to have learned in life that just because something might look like it would be better when it gets changed, doesn't always work that way. There's been so much change in all the sports in my life between the different rules and the teams and the divisions and all of that. I would just like a few years where everything just stays the same. Yeah. You know all that pushback against the hip drop tackle being banned? Yeah. Wouldn't you know it's uh, John Harbaugh, who's a star guy. Mark Andrews got injured by a drop tackle last year. Actually is okay with there no longer being hip drop tackles. Huh. Well, he pointed... I mean, it's it's going to be... Now, what I heard somebody say, mm -hmm. what, oh, save by Bob. I forget who this was. Yeah. But they kind of insinuated that they felt like, um, at least for the first year, mm -hmm. it won't be so much of a, they're going to call a lot of penalties for that, but guys will get fined after the fact. They'll go back and review the games and be like, hey, you shouldn't have done that. You Here's your fine. I see. Now, whether or not, I mean, that was their opinion, but it, it that would be at least, you know, yeah. that would give the guys some kind of leeway there. I mean, these guys have been tackling the same way for years. That is not going to be something that's just easy, easy done where, you know, nobody does it. And it's also, you know, the whole uh, interpretation for the, for the refs, you know, what's that? Yeah, that's um, MJ. Uh, let's see, MJ. Thank you for the thank five. Thank you, MJ. Thank you for the five, MJ. Says Jaws. I watched the review video and saw you mentioned the story about your first kiss. Nice, <laughs> lol. You were a Casanova back in the day. Oh, Lundell oh. nearly had a goal. Oh, right in front, Rodriguez. Rodriguez! You <laughs> bastard! You can't score ever. Dennis just, That's going to come back to bite us one of these playoff games. Still, Dennis still doesn't know what to think about the play-ins in basketball. I think they're cool. Are we really going to keep take Cousins off the second line so Rodriguez can stay in the top nine? Bolvar says, I meant don't get the broom if you make the playoffs that and don't cave with three oh. games to go. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, Marlins beat the Yankees. I am genuinely surprised by that. Penguins up one nothing over Detroit. Penguins going to Stanley Cup. <laughs> yeah, if I for whichever team manages to get two points in that game, especially if they hold the opponent to zero, that's going to have seismic implications on the playoff race. Let's Good see. Boy, so, I you don't, oh, we haven't <laughs> scored again. You don't get bread when we don't score. MJ, have you watched the video I made? The NHL Eastern Conference Playoff Race Madness video. I wrote that entire skit myself. Mucho Mango has been a member for two months. Thank you, Mucho. Thank Says, you, buddy. Good day, Panthers fam. Hope everyone's doing outstanding. Yes. Oh, uh oh. Bolfar says, wait, what? The Flyers are winning. I thought they were dead. <laughs> <laughs> They're winning? Let's see. New Jersey and Toronto are tied at one. Let's see. Yeah, Philly got the first goal against the Rangers. Good for them. Oh, good job, guys. Let's see if it lasts. Yeah. You know, it's bad when you're celebrating the poor team got, a, got the first goal of the game. <laughs> yeah. Uh-oh. 
What was I doing a Tom Grassy parody? No. Um, well, it's what happens when you put Tom Grassy, uh, Brandon Perna, and urinating tree into a blender. <laughs> the Leafs are up two to one now. Okay. Bolvar says that flyer spin is why you don't lay in bed and chew gum. It's happened too many <laughs> times. Oh. Yeah, watch the Flyers beat the Rangers because hockey makes no sense. Right. Derek, you'd laugh if the Flyers make it in. Nerful says, hopefully the Bruins don't pass the Rangers for first in the East. Yeah. One one Detroit Pittsburgh. That game is now tied. I see you, Fluffy. Huh? It's still very possible that the Blue Bruins can play the wild card too. If the Rangers lose tonight and their next game and the Bruins win out, they will be ahead. Don't do it. I want the narratives I established in my skit to last. I'll make a follow-up, a shorter video oh, yeah yeah the end, yeah well when the field is finally okay. finalized all right i'll make a shorter skit video that's basically you started up with previously in the eastern conference madness yeah and, and then you yeah, show yeah, yeah. what it was like and then i you cut to now okay i'm gonna Matthews just Austin Matthews just got a 67th goal. I took a picture of you. Huh? Fine. You're so spoiled for me. I don't know how you got this. <laughs> Sit there and stare at me and beg. All right. Okay. Tonight, we congratulated the Panthers on our original television play-by-play -play broadcast. Our good friend wow, that's Jeff Rimmer. Wow, yeah. he got old. <laughs> Holy crap. Wow. I didn't even recognize him. Oh, he's retiring. Yeah. Yeah, Rimmer was good. He was? Yeah, yeah, he was good. That's pretty awesome. True says, hey, guys, my first break of the day. Let's go, Panthers. Hey, Hello. Lundell in the face-off circle. It's already just 12.50 to go in the first. Kulikov's shot is blocked. Booster Ryan in around the boards. Now it's in the neutral zone, so the Panthers have to. Uh-oh. Lundell. Lundell is uh, not happy with whatever just happened to him. Idog says, Kyle's video was hilarious, especially the column part. Thank you. <laughs> I wrote that entire skit myself. Yeah. And what's funny is everyone is enjoying the Leafs bit. I didn't even, when I wrote the script, I didn't even write it with the intention of having that be a golem bit. Yeah. I just realized it would be too perfect. Yeah. And that one you only had one take on. Yeah. Yeah. Some of them you had like a do half dozen takes, ten takes. I had multiple takes for for the Gollum bit. I don't remember. The one I did not do multiple takes for was the Flyers choking. Okay, yeah. I don't think I watched another take for the for the Gollum one. I couldn't because it was taking me so long to watch some of the other ones. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so. Ice and I is watching the Blue Jackets feed to get the old announcer. What was the Golem impression supposed to mean? When you've been waiting for the precious since 1967, like Steve Dangle once yeah. said, you should look up. There is a specific uh, LFR video from years and years back where Steve Dangle had to watch the team lose like nine 
nine two to the Nashville Predators, and then Steve pulled out like a perfect Gollum impression. <laughs> so we're on the power play, PB time. Trey says, I blame Jaws for you mispronouncing Iserman. Yeah, because I said Iserman. You did it. All you of your takes said Ezer. None of them said Iser. None of the takes that you finished anyway. Dave says, Pacharo Kyle nailed the Leafs exactly. Did, the very first Jaws did not oh, direct close. the Kyle video. I wrote and recorded that entire thing. All Jaws did was the editing, which I also directed in part. All right. Could we actually score on the man advantage, please? This is Columbus we're playing. So Tarasenko couldn't reach it. Yeah, Manhattan's landed on the moon the last time the Leafs won the cup. Kucherov has 140 points. 30 seconds left on. Oh, oh, that's another shot. Why are the Blue Jackets yeah, blocking Jack shots? Yeah. All right, you got one last chance. That's right. I forget Erica Branson is on the Blue Jackets. Oh, yeah, that's right. They threw him a four by four. I know. TK says Kyle, the audience demands Dinkle spoof videos for the playoffs. <laughs> You're a good one. All right. Nine twelve left. Dave, what's going on in Toronto? Let's see. So nine minutes to go in the first. The excitement is kind of a uh, left after. Well, yeah, I mean we scored in the first twenty seconds, right? The first uh, forty, whatever yeah. it was. Oh. Chicken Doidle says this game has already felt a hundred years long. The Leafs are up 3 2. Oh! Stenland once again had a golden opportunity and just couldn't uh, put it past. Uh, who is the. I know, I probably Lorenz and not Pozo. No, I mean the Blue Jackets goalie. Oh, I never heard of this kid. They gave the stats before the game. Wait a minute. Video review in Toronto. It was called offside, still 2 2. Okay. Toronto does not have ah. a lead. Bob Jeez, with the save. A, yeah, okay. Good job, Bob. That was another almost goal provided by Oliver Ekman Larson. What's going on with this dude? Buffy, you can't just sit there and whine at me every 30 seconds to get food. Huh? Nobody feels bad for you. Everybody knows you get, like, attention all day. 
Oh. Oh. Come on. Oh. Huh? You're not fooling anybody. Oh, no. You're going to do the mope because you don't get more food now? No, he's laughing because he's getting attention. Huh? Why is Bob out there? Because uh, John Maurice is a stubborn old man. <laughs> Maybe we plan on having Stoli as our hot head. I mean, he's practically getting the night off anyway. They've got three shots on goal. Thank you. Huh? Okay, wake me up when. Oh, give me my binky. Jameson says, I can't believe as a Canucks fan, I'm worried the Oilers might win out the rest of the season and take the division. Really? Are they that close? Well, who are. Who do the Oilers even play? Uh, let's see. Yeah, the Oilers are. Two, the Oilers are four points out with two games in hand. You're not going to. Come on, you can't do that, Vancouver. Well, let's see. What are you doing? Their the last last five games. You ready for this for the Oilers? Arizona, Vancouver, San Jose, Arizona, Colorado. Jeez. Oh, that's what's that. It's the. Oh, autism towels. That's what's at the stadium. I was in that sensory quiet room for about yeah. five minutes. Yeah. It's nice. Hey, MJ, thank you for the five. Thank you, MJ. Thank you, thank you, thank you, MJ. Says, thank you, buddy. Trivia time. Trivia name, time. Name an NHL goaltender that has won four Stanley Cups or four. more. Four answers to come in the second. Four. I guess Grant Fuhrer with Edmonton would have to be the one that I would think of. Fast. He was their goalie during the '80s run with the right. Faster K9 asks, "Hey, who do you guys not want to face in the first round?" Tampa. Tampa. I mean, I'd rather <laughs> face Tampa than Boston, but Boston's not on the menu. So, of the teams that it could possibly still be, definitely Tampa. What? You're so spoiled, Fluffy. You're just sitting there crying at me. 6.58 to go. <laughs> That was shot wide by the Blue Jackets. Over to Tarasenko. Tarasenko over to Reinhardt, but that puck is deflected. Mikola unable to hold it in, but we do have it just at the center ice. Now we dump in Tarasenko at the circle. giving his own commentary. Oh. Boy, that's a big, fat, juicy rebound. What was well, that? What are you doing? Hello. Hello, Rick. Looks like we were just going for the change. That is a uh, Bolinskis, correct? Yeah. Yeah, that guy's okay. He's good. And knocked down with a high stick. Why are they shoving Lundell around tonight? Somebody's going to need to beat the crap out of somebody tonight. Mm. Okay. This is this is too much excitement for me, pal. We could be watching Red Wings versus Penguins, but no. Uh, well, you know, don't complain about it too much, you know. <laughs> right? It's 2-2 two -two in the first period with 828 left of Devil's Maple Leafs. Yeah, it was 3-2, but they took away a goal due to offsides, I believe. Flyers are still winning one nothing. Capital Savers, no score. 
Senators and Lightning are one one. Amon St. Calvin sent. <laughs> That's a great. <laughs> That's like all the Lions' best receivers in one name. Says uh, Panthers versus Red Wings Eastern Conference Finals. That could is that even possible? That is totally legit. That could totally happen. Lightning are up yeah, two to one. Yeah, yeah. Excuse me. So They said the goals are slowing down because no one scored for two minutes. <laughs> Bolvar says, can you give Drew Brees his jersey retirement already? New Orleans has been long enough. Hmm. They might be uh, waiting to see if he'll pull a Tom Brady. Right? I doubt it. Oh, oh, oh. This stream is just devolved into a fluffy whining. Now we're just waiting to see if something. <laughs> oh my god, you're funny, Fluffy. Huh? Oh, oh, here we go. Rodriguez just completely just, with he just can't. He just can't. I've never seen a guy get the number of chances he gets and just do nothing with him ever. There's another goal. It's three two devils. Wow. TK says Owen Rodriguez. Uh, hey, don't don't put any uh, stank on Owen Tippett's name now. Tippett scored goals while he was here. Nobody appreciated it. Cooch has 141 points now. Hmm. Ah, jeez. Oh, oh, it went right past Lorenz. And now it's Lorenz tried to feed Bennett directly in the slot. Okay. 405 to go in the first. This is riveting. I'm I'm still marveling at how slow Ocpozo is. Yeah, Duffels are now winning to... Excuse me. Almond St. Calvin Center says uh, oh. Leafs Oh, the kid safe. makes a save. Leafs have no defense. Oh. He settled down. He got tired of me making fun of him. All right. That's what it is. His jersey has Captain Florida. But on yours, they put Captain Captain. Yeah. Yeah. That's what they did. So that is, that is a goof. I don't know. Why would you have I, I two don't feeds know. that say I, I, captain? I would have to do some you'd, you'd want to research that first. There's all sorts of like you said, if it's a French version, 
Maybe that's how they do it in France. Well, technically, that's just the uh, that's just the jersey with the same uh, French language NHL logo that the uh, Montreal Canadiens too. Oh, geez, that was close. TK says so. Bob against Boston on Saturday. No, I I think this should be Bob's last game. Honestly. I would hope this is his last game. No, Owls, it's it's fine. I don't I don't want to return that jersey. No, no, no. If Barkov's name, if had it been... is a mistake, it's it's a, a one of a kind. Yeah. <laughs> it doesn't look like a knockoff jersey or anything. No, no, it's great. It's like a coin that's got a, what do they call that? Like an error? Like an error coin, strike. Yeah, there's double die coins. Yeah. Oh! Nerful says that Maurice said he has the Ottawa Columbus and Sabres game already chosen for who starts, and he'll decide on the Toronto game based on whether it matters or not. Hmm. I don't believe a damn thing that man says, to be honest with you. Owl says, okay, just let me know if you decide you want to return it. All you have to do is just... Have me email you guys the label. I can send a new one. Up. No, no, no. I, I, I like it, even if it is a mistake. Hmm. Yeah, we don't, we don't play Boston. We play Buffalo. Yeah, I know. I know you said Boston, but I thought it was just a misspeak. Um, someone had said Boston. Okay. Oh, it's Greaves. That's who we're. Okay. That's the goalie we're playing against. Dennis says it's nice to have Bob going into the playoffs on a heater. Yeah, just as long as he doesn't get too worn out. <laughs> even, even Goldie is. It's like, geez, what am I supposed to call in here? He's, <laughs> you hear him? He gets disgusted with me because he knows I'm making fun of him. Okay, All right, that's the, that's the end of the. I got to go try to make this entertaining in a recap. I should get paid double. A pa me. Panthers. I know I depicted you as sound asleep in my video, but that doesn't right? mean you have to put us to sleep. I don't need to be going there. Try to find one of the other games while we're in the intermission. The Red Wings and Penguins game is right here. That sucker is going right on. Yeah, there you go. Unless it's also an intermission. Penguins up 2-1. Did they just score? I yep. guess they just scored. Yep. Darn it. I just, we and just that was on Lion, too. Spaceman Sports says, bring in the puppets in that recap. He says, go pens just because. Hey, Cuban, thank you for the two. Thank you for the two, Cuban. Says, what tastes better than it smells? Hmm. Jacob says we need to watch the Marlins now. I'm good. 
Dennis says, the Marlins have given me heartburn. Yeah, the Marlins actually beat the Yankees. Yeah, yeah, I'm watching the Pence versus Wings game now. About forty, about forty six seconds in is when the uh, Panthers, uh, Kachuk scored for the Panthers, and then literally nothing else happened after that in the first period. The Mets. Beat the Braves sixteen to four. Adonis says that met the Mets beat the Braves sixteen to four. You need dinner? I gave you all three meals. You need four? Just spoil brat. He just wants more attention. Uh, Buffalo scored first against Washington. Can't go losing to Buffalo, Washington. Buffalo is trying to doom the Capitals. Rangers, Rangers and Flyers tied at one. The Breadman scored. Oh, that was very close for Crosby. Dave says, I'm running the Leafs game, but Shelly, you're keeping an eye on the enemy. So less than two minutes to go in the first of the uh, Detroit and Pittsburgh game. Eisen Ice is one of my friends who is a Wings fan, wants us to trade Knights to the Wings ASAP. I don't I don't think so. Vegas signs Noah Hennevin to an eight-year extension. Wow. Didn't they just acquire him? So, yeah, the the Panthers and Blue Jackets game wasn't very exciting in that first period, save for the one goal the uh, the Panthers scored. Yeah, Bolfar is wondering how the hell the Golden Knights are going to play, going to pay Marchi. The puppy. Who should we keep for next year, Knight or Stolars? I have a feeling Stolars is going to win out. Yeah, I heard about that. The Packers and Eagles are going to play in Brazil in the first week of the football season. All right, come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Let's go. I got your food. Come on. Come on. Get up. Let's go. Come on. Come on, chicken head. Let's go. Come on. Chase Claypool is going to the Canadian Football League. Yeah, 
Interesting. Boy, do we have some some uh, grass to mow. <laughs> Pacharo says Chase Claypool is going to the Canadian Football League. Oh, that's oh, oh, my, oh god. my god! The what Red Wings goal. just tied it. That was a hell of a goal. Wow! Is that what real hockey looks like? Yeah. <laughs> Jeez. Eisen Knight says there was an article I read earlier predicting where the UFA class ends up this offseason, and they picked Rhino to end up in Columbus. Oh my god! I want whatever that guy was smoking. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure he's going to leave for Columbus. Jeez, what a beautiful ball! Yeah, that was Raymond for the Devils. Dang. Who is faster, Mikola, Ocposo, or Fluffy? Oh, now, wait a minute now. Mikola's not that slow. <laughs> Ocposo and Fluffy, that would be a close, that would be a close race. Depends on how far they have to run. Flyers, <laughs> Rangers. Fluffy would probably win the first 10 feet. Then that, that's about it. Let's see him. Cuban, thank you for the two. Thank you, Cuban. Thank you, Cuban. Says, I'm hearing Stamp Coast wants to come to the Cats. <laughs> oh, uh, no. I mean, if he wants to come play, uh, you know, no, for free. If there's anybody we're paying money through this summer not named Reinhardt, it's going to be Tarasenko. Let's see. <laughs> All right. Bull. <laughs> Dennis says, sign Rhino and Tarasenko and trade night. Hello, Mason. Bolvar says, no, put Brad Marchand on the Panthers. <laughs> League's worst nightmare. All right, so we're just waiting for the Panthers and Blue Jackets game to come back from the intermission. So, how do you think we look so far? We're just, uh, <laughs> we're just waiting for the playoffs at this rate. Kucherov is two assists away from a hundred assists. Sabres winning. How do I feel about signing Marcia so if we lose Rhino? No, we're no. not going to lose Rhino. Reinhardt is not going anywhere. 
And Marshall Silk can get in line behind Tierra Senko. Reinhardt hasn't signed yet because he's waiting to see if Montour is going to sign. Because if Montour signs, it's going to be another hyper team friendly deal, which means Reinhardt's going to have to take less money to keep the whole band together. But if Montour leaves, Horsling will get, or uh, uh, Reinhardt will get closer to the money that he wants. He ain't leaving. So, like Randy Muller mentioned throughout the first period, the Florida Panthers did not spend a lot of time in their own zone. And one of the reasons they were able to get the puck out quickly, a play that you wanted to look Let's at. Let's see right now. Buffalo is beating Washington 1 0. New Jersey is beating Toronto 3 2. Tampa Bay is beating Ottawa 2 to 1. Rangers and Flyers are tied at 1. The Penguins and Red Wings are tied at 2. Yeah, and that's about it for the scores. The Montreal and uh, New York Islanders game is still tied at 0. Is the game in Toronto over? Not yet. So here's the question, Jovo. How do you break through against Jet Greaves? Obviously, after all of the tremendous saves that he made in the first period. Owl says at least the Caps are losing. Heard all y'all talk about the forecheck being an area of them to keep on pressuring them. You're going to get those turnovers. And you keep throwing it to net. They're going to go in. I think the goaltenders have had a good first period. But you continue throwing all the right. pressure at him. You're going to get these opportunities when you do have that chance. The best know. words a Vegas fan can read here. If you pick Marshy in the expansion draft, we will also trade you Smith for nothing. All right. The second period will be starting in just a couple minutes. Don't forget, Carl. What? You only got about another week that you can save. Mm. All right, buddy. You want to come in? Hello, Simon. How are you? How are you doing? Full for I plan on doing my last shave to coincide coincide as closely as I can with the final regular season game. Okay. Come on. Okay. All right. Okay. This is the uh, boy, sugar, huh? Yes. How about ice cream or? Uh, how much ice cream is left? I'll go see. All right. I'll be back. Hey, everybody. Yes, yeah, scoreboard watching as the wings itself is crazy. Yeah, massive. There's some games with massive implications. Can the Capitals beat the Sabers? Who comes out on top in the Detroit versus Pittsburgh contest? Simply stunning. What's this? She's opening her fidelity app to buy that stock with no fees or conditions. Because what does Gina got? Gina's got the look. I'll never get sold. Talk about easier investing. Toby, why aren't you eating your Cinnabon full part? Well, I wanted to save
eat your breakfast. Maybe I just smell it. The best part of Wendy's new breakfast Cinnabon Pull Apart is all the parts. <laughs> Now's so, Drive a new Honda Noah Hannafin got eight by seven point three five million. Good grief! Can the Flyers actually win? I don't know. A team that loses six two to Columbus and nine three to Montreal seems pretty dead in the water to me. So, my dad is busy getting us ice cream. Yeah, Dennis, um, you saw the video I made, right? The NHL Eastern Conference playoff madness. I think you'll you would enjoy the depiction of the Flyers. Let's see. John says intermission in Toronto, and they're asking, should Matthews and Marner be on separate lines in the playoffs? The panel say yes. So, how how is it? No, we're good. Yay. Um. So you know how Reinhardt got eight years and five point seven five million. Yes. Yeah, Forsling. Yeah, well, Forsling. Yeah, Forsling. Yeah. Yeah. Guess how much um they gave uh, Noah Hannafin over in Vegas for the same amount of years? How much? It's eight years, seven point three five million. Jeez, they still didn't. He's still not making as much as Ekblad makes. Okay. All right. It's only two weeks to the NFL draft, apparently. Simon says the Leafs have a good offensive, good offense, but they have no defense and goalie. For me, it's not a contender. Good job. Mm. We both have ice cream. Well, there's so much action to call. Yeah. I can see where it would be a problem. Hello, Carolyn. Hello. How you? How are you doing? We're we're doing okay. We are anxiously awaiting the playoffs. Mm -hmm. you okay, bud. Yeah. Because these last few regular season games have been so exciting. Yeah, this is uh. I mean, we were still in must-win mode at this point last year, right? Yeah, I think so. This would have been the game that we – the last one that we won in regulation. Mm -hmm. Come on. Give us some excitement. Don't get anyone injured, though. Yeah, not that much excitement. Mm -hmm. 
Is this the last of the ice cream? Um, the peanut butter chocolate's gone. There's one more serving for you, or the other one. Mm. That's good to hear, Carolyn, that you're doing good. Here comes Lorenz. Nothing. Ah. Yeah, we do eat like kings. <laughs> Kulikov looking. Oh, it was a save. No one could get the rebound. That's Ocposo in the corner, and it goes straight to the Blue Jackets. So, mm -hmm. the last game, we scored two quick goals and then just rode that the rest of the way. Mm -hmm. Are we trying to one up ourselves and just ride the one goal the whole way. <laughs> if we can do it against the Hurricanes, we can certainly do it against the Blue Jackets. <laughs> you remember that game? Yes. Yes. Spent the whole game. You're going to get that second goal, right? Right. You need a second goal, right? Fifteen. Only five minutes have passed. At least we didn't pay to go to the game. Yeah. Bennett loses the puck. Yeah, come on, Cousins. Do something. Somebody do something. Damn it. Yeah, this is a snooze fest special. All right, I guess uh, I'm going to have to get inebriated, so it's interesting. Well, we can always tune in to Red Wings Penguins. Actually, at this point, I'm just amazed that... Oh, oh, here he goes again! Jesus! I The guy is amazing! I mean, the number of chances and breakaways and good shots that he has without being able to put one in the back of the net. It is a skill. It is an absolute skill. Tampa scored. Go ahead. I'm starting to see why he's bounced around from team to team to team. He's He's got a good game to him, but he just cannot put the puck in the net. What were you about to say at this point? You were just surprised that. Uh, I was saying at this point, I'm just surprised at how boring the game could consistently be. Yeah. Are we really going to bump Cousins from the second line when Verhage comes back just to keep Rodriguez in the in the top nine? Leave I'm, Cousins there, put Verhage with – honestly, put Verhage back up top. Leave Cousins where he is. Put Tarasenko with Lundell and Lucien Ryan. And, and if Rodriguez wants to see the ice, he can be on the fourth line. I mean, you want to talk about – Cousins shouldn't be in the top nine because he can't score. Jeez. Give somebody else a chance with all those chances Rodriguez gets. 
God. I have something to bitch about. Strafasi <laughs> says Rodriguez should go to the bench when Verhage is back. Nerfle says Erod for sure won't be on the fourth line. He'll either be third line or scratched. Maurice is figuring out his fourth line combos the last few games. Let's see. Right now, the time is 13.24, and face-off just happened. Oh, no. No, we're just waiting for okay the puck. Ah, Kulikov can't keep it in. Ah. Jacob says you have to wonder if Rodriguez is replicating Duclair's first year with Florida, where he would miss practically every opportunity, <laughs> then proceeded to pot in 30 plus goals his second year. Well, I mean, we got him signed, so I suppose we're going to get a chance to figure that out. Stenland is in the penalty box. Okay. We are on the PK. All right, PPK. Yeah. Here we go. Here Going we go. shorty. No. Oh, uh, that Ocpozo hat trick ain't looking so good, by the way. Whoever that was that predicted it. I'm not Stop sure. blocking shots. Not sure if he was joking, joking or not. Jacob says, honestly, the inconsistency in secondary scoring is why we need the Tarasenko, why we need Tarasenko, why we could use the young prospects like Sam Moskevich finally being put into the lineup for next season at least. I would assume he's going to get a shot next year, but he may not. It depends. If, if we somehow find the money and Tarasenko stays – the only way you can have room for Sam Miskevich in that top nine is to um, move Rodriguez. Hey, MJ, thank you for the Ted. Hey, thank you, MJ. Thank you, thank you, thank you, buddy. Says, thank you, MJ. Much appreciated. Here are the answers to my trivia question. Yeah, this I got to hear because that was, that was not easy. Ken Dryden, Jocks Plant, Turk Broda. Patrick Wall, Grant Fur, yeah. Billy Smith, Johnny Bauer, Gump Worsley, and Terry Sawchuck. That's a lot more than I thought. Let's see. Someone wanted to know what the Lightning score is. The Tampa Bay Lightning are beating the Sens 2 1 at the moment. All right, nine seconds left on the power play kill. I mean, are we really going to try to to run, roll that one that one goal the whole way? Well, we killed the penalty. Up 
Oh, they just left the puck back there. <laughs> that was that could have gone all sorts of wrong. Can we do something like we have a penalty shot? Something? Give Rodriguez the puck. At least it's some kind of excitement. You can all you can get the puck at center ice and we'll place our bets. Jacob says they're playing playoff hockey jaws, maintaining that one goal lead. Jeez. My heart can't take that crap in two weeks from now. Game four got a two to one series lead. It's one to nothing with five minutes left. Uh-uh. <laughs> I better get some nitroglycerin if that's how it's gonna be. And still won't go in the net. Kulikov. Oh, what the hell was that? Space oh, that was almost too many men. They need to rest Baba. Uh, Baba. That's what I'm hoping. Well, he's kind of getting a rest tonight. I mean. Jeez, Stanley can't score either. That's three times. Why are they blocking shots? <laughs> Try auditioning for next year, maybe? I guess. Yeah. Although, who would want to stay in Columbus? Well, if a guy's on the bubble of being an NHL player, if just nobody can put it in. Oh, for well, freaking hell. You know, if you're a bubble NHL or you want to put good stuff on tape. What? Another penalty? Wait, a high stick or knock down with a high stick? Oh, well. That was almost exciting. Buffy did it. Flyers up 2 1. Oh, yeah. That's the scores. Let's see. Let's see what the scores. What do we got? Stedland's battling no, no, Rodriguez no. for offensive ineptitude. Red Wings and Penguins are still 2 2. Flyers 2, Rangers 1. Lightning 2, Senators 1. Sabres 1. Capitals nothing. Oh, is Washington going to blow it to the Sabres? <laughs> oh. The Sabres are... Devils 3, Maple Leafs 2. Yeah. If Toronto wins that game and we win our game, I think that means we would clinch second place. You mean if Toronto loses yeah, that Yeah, that's game. what I... Well, yeah, that's what I mean. I don't know what I said, but that's what I mean. Habs... Because at that point... Hold on. Go ahead. At that point... You would have a hundred. They'd be five points back, and they would have three games left. So no, we would not clinch. We would need one more point. Habs won nothing over the Islanders after one. What got into Montreal? Are they starting to try to win games now. Was that success? Another team, and not only Columbus and a few others, but the Buffalo Sabres and Masters had their number. Oof, it was a steal, a wraparound attempt, and then hey, good order, Fluffy. We get lucky. Reinhardt was right there by the side of the net. Forsling almost loses the puck entirely. No, nope. Greaves makes another save. Okay. Oh, right. 
You know, the fuckers will sleep over there. Playoff, wake me up when the playoff starts. Hey, Christian, how you doing? How does a team that loses to Montreal 9-3 have a 2-1 lead versus the Rangers? <laughs> exactly. Did the Flyers and Rangers change uniforms? Uh, it's just that happens these last week, two weeks of the season. Yeah. You see weird things like that. Bennett, another save. This goalie's playing a good game. There yeah. you go. There we go. He's already Damn made it. 21 saves. We've had literally twice as many shots. Twice as many shots we as... We have twice as many goals. Actually, no, that's not twice as many, dumbass. That's the only... There is no... Ah! Or well, maybe it is twice as many. Hello, I see that, boy. Is one twice as many as zero? Is that classified, qualified as that? I think... Um... Every multiple of zero is zero. So there cannot be two times or three times a zero, right? Even though it kind of is, it kind of isn't, right? Yeah. It's like a trick question. Cousins! Uh-oh. Oh, crap. Save! Bubba! Bubba, 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 Bubba! Bub. There you go, Bubba. That's not easy to do. Like, no action for 10 minutes, and all of a sudden there's a 2 on 0 coming your way? Yeah. Taunts is asking, why isn't, why isn't it 4-sip already? <laughs> Matthews got his 68th goal. Yeah. The Wings game is still tight. <laughs> Dave says he's got to sleep. Good luck. Okay. Yeah, Cousins with a ridiculous turnover. Wait, why are you leaving the game if you got to sleep? This is the perfect thing to put you to sleep. <laughs> yeah, 68 goals for Matthews. Jeez. It'd be hilarious if he ends up with 69 goals. <laughs> Penguins score. Again? Yeah. Poor Alex Lyon. Was it Crosby? Yeah! <laughs> Rodriguez. God almighty. Did you please... Put anybody else in that spot right now so that they will score from all these chances. Sidney Crosby did score. He's gone super scion. <laughs> he will show no mercy. <laughs> he will raise everything to the ground, and then he will take the Penguins to the Stanley Cup finals. <laughs> no. I look forward very much to tuning in to Red Wings Penguins <laughs> right? at the end of this period. And it's most it's likely that the Red Wings Penguins game will still be going after this game is over. Hey MJ, thank you for the 10. Thank you, MJ. Thank you, thank you, thank you, MJ. Says, thank you, buddy. Trivia time part two okay. without using Google in the last 35 years. Which Stanley Cup Finals went six games and which went seven? Oh, jeez. Now using Google. Devils Toronto. Five years? Devils Toronto tied again. Four. Derek immediately followed it up with four three 
four free Leafs over Devils. Oh, as soon as I said something. And Sabres up 2 nothing over Capitals so wow, far. Wow, the Capitals are going to blow it to the Sabres? <laughs> Matthews could score his 70th in the Panthers arena. <laughs> Let it happen in the regular last regular season game and then hold them to nothing in the playoffs. Right. Austin thinks the loser of Red Wings and Penguins will probably be eliminated. Yeah. Hey, Taunts, thank you for the five. Thank you, Taunts. Says, thank you, buddy. Please get Erod out of the lineup. He <laughs> couldn't hit the broad side of a barn right now. Hi, puppy. Hi. Play responsibly. Sergey Bobrovsky with a one nothing lead on his former team. Yeah, looking for his 35th win of the season. And you can take a look at the Russian Let's see. Yeah, Sean says it's a birthday game before both him and Monty. Happy birthday, Sean. Did you hear that? What's that? Sean, Sean says it's a birthday game for both him and Monty. Oh, very cool. Happy birthday. Sean, yeah, and it's Montour's it's birthday. Montour's, Montour's birthday? Yeah. Very cool. Happy birthday. What are you, uh, 14 or, or 15 this year? <laughs> I don't know. I'm kidding. I'm teasing. I don't know how old he is. He could be 15, 25, 35, 45, 55. It could be any of those. You'd <laughs> see. If I had the time, at the end of the year, I would make a well, compilation. I would make an Evan Rodriguez compilation. Yeah. But not the good kind. <laughs> John says, Did you hear that? Otani's interpreter, it wasn't just $4 million he stole from Shohei Otani. I didn't know. It was $14 million. Oh, that's a big difference. Yeah. Will we stream the NFL draft? Yeah. Well, maybe. Um, It depends on the NHL playoffs. Yeah. The NHL playoffs will take precedent over it but so we'll have to see what what that goes i doubt that there would be a hockey game during the first round or a first nfl first round although maybe there was last year okay bud Good boy. would we stream the nhl draft um, we don't even have a first rounder. Yeah, I mean, we should wait we, until we, 2026 for that. The thing with us streaming the NHL draft is that I may as well stream. Um, we we don't we don't follow it really much to do with the with the you know the AHL and any of the minor leagues, so I would not know anything about any of the players. Greaves makes the safe. So, I mean, we could do it to just hang out, but in terms of getting any in, informative commentary from us would be lacking. Sidney Crosby is the first player to enter the NHL's top 10 points list since Yaramir Yager did it over 16 years ago on in February 19th, 2008. Wow. Would we do the NFL draft? Probably, but yeah. If, if it doesn't if it doesn't con conflict with, with playoffs, with play with hockey playoffs, yeah. Oh. NFL draft, I believe it's the twenty fifth. Sean says Erod is literally making me drink more twenty dollar arena cocktails. Yeah, so April twenty. Rodriguez. And he was right oh there. Oh, my God. How do you not score? 
Get another one, Sean. <laughs> the NFL draft is April 25th. So, if the Panthers series starts on the 20th, oh my God, here he comes again. They, oh my God. <laughs> Lundell, he still he finally did it. He, he finally did it. <laughs> it took finally. Lundell to put now Reed let's completely see. Did it go out off, of Was it Lundell off of Rodriguez? Did it go off the defenseman skate? They're giving it to Rodriguez, but let's see. <laughs> okay, so he loses it there. Then Lundell. No, he Rodriguez did. finally did Rodriguez it. finally. He finally put one in. Todd says hell is frozen <laughs> over. <laughs> Great. Now Maurice is going to yeah. boost Cousins off the yeah, top nine. That's it. Cousins just lost his job again. Shoot. <laughs> Call it. Uh, you know what, Rod, you know what shirt Rodriguez is going to wear now? What? The bullshit is real. <laughs> Dennis says Rodriguez scoring is like a solar eclipse. <laughs> Colin says Erod is the new Nick Cousins. <laughs> right. Uh, All right. So now it's two nothing. Now it's a little bit more comfortable. Here we go again. A two-on-one that Montour has to defend as Mikola rapidly comes Good back. Job. Did he just miss the net? I don't even think well, that one it was a save. All right, two minutes left in the period. Now, don't do anything stupid, Panthers. Do I think Ryan Leaf is the worst NFL quarterback? No. Who would you pick? Oh, they did not see Cleo Lemon play. Cleo Lemon. I've heard about uh, Johnny Football yeah. and uh, – uh, Nathan Peter meme, Nathan Peterman, that guy huh. who was a Bills quarterback. Oh, I see. Hey, you. Daniel, the beach bum. Hey, thank, thank you, Daniel. Two. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, buddy. Says Erod scored time to buy a lotto ticket. Yeah, no joke, right? Well, hey, look. It, this was a good warm up for me in the playoffs. Hey, look, there's Good Branson because I bitched the entire period about him, and he finally scored. <laughs> Derek says Jamarcus Russell. Oh God. Yeah. Sean says Erod's eighth chance finally scores. Girlfriend calls it. Help me, Lord. <laughs> Spaceman Sports says Cousins should play with Rempe to make the Rangers dirtier. <laughs> um, that reminded me someone when 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 we were talking about the Capitals score, it's two to one now. Okay. I'm caught in rooting for Washington to get that last spot. Yeah? Yeah, just for the old man's sake. We got the same beard. I, I would. It Ish. would be hilarious if the Penguins got third in the Metro, which is uh. entirely possible. Yeah, yeah right now. Oh, there we go. All right. Nice. That was sweet. There was no room there. Wow. Hey, look, the crowd showed up too. Good stuff. So, with less than a minute to go in the second, the Panthers take a 3 0 lead, and okay. Sam, Sam Reinhardt gets his 54th yeah, goal. He's trying to catch Matthew. He's only 14 <laughs> goals behind him. Oh, that poor kid didn't even see the shot. Because yeah. look at, look at, Bar who is that? Barkoff with Tarasenko's right in front. <laughs> the kid didn't even see the shot, man. That's beautiful. Nice. Okay. Now we can just chillax. All right. Okay, very good stuff. We already have scored more goals than we did against the Sens than yes. the last game. Yes. I mean, that uh, Greaves was doing a great job. Oh, he did. He did. I mean, either one of those two goals are his fault. You know what I mean? Yeah. 
Sports says plus 10,000 to Reinhardt's contract. Jeez. Icy says just get out healthy. Yeah, that's the ultimate goal right yes. now. Yeah, I want to see a lot of that fourth line in the third period. Derek says, as I've said, the Flyers play well versus good teams with crap the bad versus bad teams. Hey, Taunts, thank you for the five. Thank you, Taunts. Thank you, thank you, thank you, brother. Thank you, says, thank you Taunts. Erod, finally, geez. Yes. It's an amazing year. Beautiful. So the Reinhardt and Verhage scoring duo, duo just tied Bure and Whitney oh, okay. for most for a highest scoring duo in franchise history. We haven't been this. We haven't had a duo this explosive in well over twenty years. <laughs> Sports short dozens. Oh, if that goes in, my banner says it's three to nothing. For what? Well, Sports Shorts was saying the banner said 0-0. Zero, zero. Dennis says, I needed this last night. Gave me indigestion. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> a, okay. A Flyers fan tossed a jersey on the ice. Oh, man. Somebody grab it and send it to me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here we go. No, don't. Oh, oh my gee, God. Love side. Love side online. Look at that. Oh, Peter Pedersen tried to. That's that's Lions Glove, man. I love the dude, but Brian glove, Rust man. has had three points tonight. Go ahead. Just you... saying, Boston exposed that glove last year. Yeah. So the Penguins just made it four two over the Red Wings with, uh. Just over seven oh, minutes to go in the second. And got motivated. Yeah. <laughs> the Blackhawks are no longer the worst team this season. It's now the Sharks. You wonder if Johnny Gaudreau regrets signing with Columbus. Well, I don't think anyone saw the massive regression of Gaudreau coming. Like, it's even... It's was worse than it's been worse than Huberto after he got to Calgary, right? Wendy's orange creamsicle frosty with a tad of vodka. That that sounds pretty damn good, actually. It is the second intermission. Currently, I am watching the. Red Wings and Penguins fight for their playoff lives. Red Wings are furiously getting shot attempts. And now the Penguins are going to take it to the neutral zone. Yeah, poor Twisted Wrister. Hello, we got AO, we got both taunts in the house. So, penguins are circling around that net. Yeah, Brian Rust is having a great night. A goal and two assists, apparently. Everyone was saying that Columbus would be good if... Goudreau went there, but it was obvious that he went there to settle down his life. He doesn't care about winning. That's a take I haven't heard before. Owl says, despite the disappointing season, Johnny Goudreau insisted, I don't have any second thoughts. I, I love it here. Well, good for him. Pacharo says, Pacharo says, Kyle, the Dolphins in the draft are looking for an offensive lineman. Did you hear that? Yeah, I mean. Isn't this like year five in a row of drafting offensive linemen? The problem with us drafting an offensive lineman is that it's still the same guy drafting offensive linemen. <laughs> you know what I mean? So, I mean, what makes, you know, 
it's still the same guy draft. It's like the opposite of Bill Zito. <laughs> you know what I mean? I yeah. You How does New Jersey have three goals with only 10 shot attempts? They're playing the Leafs, right? So, yeah, second intermission between the Panthers. Panthers in the second period with some help with from Lundell Rodriguez. It took eight attempts, but Rodriguez finally scored on a wide open opportunity. And then shortly after, Reinhardt got his 54th goal of the year. Looks like the Penguins are going to be down a man. It's it's a PK for the Penguins. Let's see. Do I think the Bills are going to suck this season? No. It's going to be worse than that. They are going to be so tantalizingly close. But, you know... But they're probably not going to have the uh, manpower required to make it far in the playoffs if they do make it. Rick, you want me to give a shout out to the Anaheim Ducks fans in the channel? Are you one of them, Rick? If so, hello. Glad to see you here. Um, how are you enjoying Rad Go Goodis? Is that overpayment already starting to hurt? Hello, Rick. So in other words, you're saying the Dolphins will still lose the division. Probably. Red Wings are on the power play. This is their entire season on the line. Pittsburgh is now getting a two-on-two -two chance shorthanded. Oh! Oh! Pittsburgh came very close to making it 5-2 while shorthanded. Oh, sorry to hear that, Rick. Hey, but you, at least you get all that grit and sandpaper, right? But you're not supposed to rub the sandpaper against your skin, buddy. <laughs> huh. So, oh, apparently... With, there's over 100 people watching us, and thank you all for joining us. It's I find it interesting that only 41 of you are actually from YouTube, and it seems like the majority are actually from the combination of Twitter, Facebook, and Twitch. But yeah, glad to have you all here. <laughs> the Detroit Power Play is about to end, and... That is, uh, who is the Pittsburgh goalie? That's not Tristan Jari. Let's see. The Delkovich? The Delkovich, huh? Interesting. Hey Dana, I haven't noticed any anyone saying anything that would not be tolerated, but um, I've seen a couple Leafs fans, yes, but they have been uh, friendly right right now. I don't expect any anything to uh any situations to arise until the playoffs start. So. Hey, Dana, thank you for the $10 super sticker. Thank you, Dana. That's awesome, Dana.
Owl says that Stolarz is still number one in the league for goals against average and save percentage. Dennis says, go Devils. Hello, Rosado. The Devils apparently just scored. About three minutes to go in the second period of the Pittsburgh and Detroit game. Philadelphia has taken a 2-1 lead over the Rangers. It's 4-4 in the Devils-Leafs game. Let's see. Rosado, you have to mentally prepare for the playoffs. Good luck, buddy. It's so great to be watching the Detroit-Pittsburgh game to see what actual hockey looks like. Rosado says we could clinch the second seed tonight. I'm not sure if that's uh, I'm not sure if that's possible. The Red Wings making yet another furious attempt to score. Apparently, the Devils have. Four goals on fourteen shots. Who? Are, which goalie did the are the Leafs? Did the Leafs start tonight? So, <laughs> yeah, one thirty, one thirty-seven to go in the second between the. Pittsburgh Penguins and the Detroit Red Wings. Samsonov, huh? Yikes, yeah. That sounds about right. Rosado says you tried Marlin. Rosado, you tried Marlin's live stream last night, but the stream wouldn't work. That sucks. Well, Pittsburgh is also Pittsburgh has had four goals on sixteen shots against Alex Lyon, so it's not just Toronto who are experiencing goalie woes. Jeez, four goals on sixteen shots. Yeah. And the similar feat is happening to Samsonov, who's given up four goals on 14 shots. Jeez. And that's a game Toronto kind of needs to win in order to have any shot of overtaking us for second place. 3-1 Flyers. Good Lord, are they really about to beat the Rangers? Oh, the Red Wings score. Goal. There's no goaltending in this game. The Red Wings just made it 4-3. Is the Delkovich? The, I thought Jari was are yeah, they playing the backup. Yeah, the Pit Penguins have the Delkovich. They're playing the backup when in, in a game like this. And I guess. Well, but, what happened here? Oh. He just missed it. I mean, he just missed it. I mean, it was a good shot, right? I mean, it was perfectly placed. There's just no goaltending. Goaltending matters this time of the year, man. Yeah. As we saw. Apparently, we are only... Three free goals behind the Jets to win the Jennings Trophy. Hmm. 
which is the best goalie tandem. I see. Look at that. Okay, buddy. Settle on down. Okay. All right. Well, that's the end of the second between oh, Pittsburgh and Detroit, which means I shall switch back over to. How much time is left? Less than five minutes until the start of the third period between between the uh, Panthers and Blue Jackets. Jari has been the backup for the last few weeks during this Penguins run. Jeffrey, the score is Penguins 4, Detroit 3. Detroit made it. Detroit scored their third third goal within like I think the last minute of the period, second period. The Habs and Isles are tied. Is that a 1-1 game? Let me take a look at the scores. Let's see. Buffalo is beating Washington 2-1 at the end of the second. New Jersey and Toronto are tied at four at the end of the second. Tampa Bay has a 2-1 lead over the Senators at the end of the second. It looks like Philly is going to have a 3-1 lead over the Rangers at the end of the second. Detroit has a 4... Pittsburgh, excuse me, Pittsburgh has the 4-3 lead over Detroit at the end of the second. Montreal and the Islanders are tied at one halfway through the second. Winnipeg has a one nothing lead over Dallas at the end of the first in that game. Yeah, Jeff. <laughs> Jeffrey, like I like the Penguins fan said in my skit, the bullshit is real. Sidney Crosby has gone super scion. Todd says, "Hey, jo tell Jaws my bet that the Knights missed the playoffs is still alive." It is still alive. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I got to edit the banner. It's hard to tell if the Braves are still good taunts. They apparently just lost 16-4 to the New York Mets. If the Blues beat the Canes and Knights lose to the Wild, it's a it's a lot. <laughs> well, I doubt the Blues are gonna beat the Canes. Let's see how. The heck are the Flyers beat the beating the Rangers? I give I give up. I don't know. How do you lose six two to Columbus and nine three to Montreal, but have a three one lead against the Rangers? Let's see. Taunt, Taunt says the Blues are on the heater and the Knights look like they are more asleep than we were last week. Well, that would, that would, they would have to literally be a uh, sleep skating for that to be true. So what do you what do you think? Penguins got to Stanley Cup. What I think is I hope this period ends quickly. Yeah. 
so that we can watch a little bit of the other games at the back end. Damn it, yeah. I, I left my water. You need so, more water? I'm good. Tone says, I watched the last Golden Knights game. They are letting the other teams do whatever they want. Well, Blues, I would caution against huffing too much hopium. Even if you make it, your first round opponent is what? Dallas? Sure thing, Tons. Twisted Wrister. Hello, hello, Nick is here. Twisted Wrister's here. Hey, Says Kyle, awesome job on the skit video. I was cracking up pretty damn good. Hey, thank hey, you. Hey. I wrote that entire skit and recorded it all by myself. The only I thing did. Jaws did was the editing. Let's see. <sighs> And what an editing job it was. Yeah. <laughs> Jaws predicted exactly how much time we would take him, take him three hours. Yep. <laughs> okay. I like to move it, move it. <laughs> okay. Is it over yet? Not yet. Mm. Eighteen forty three to go in the third. Yeah, it's a great game between the Penguins and Red Wings. Yeah. Now we just have to wait for this Panthers game to be over so we can watch the rest of it. <laughs> the good news is that the Penguins Penguins and Red Wings game has been all going a lot slower apparently than right because you know it's the, the yeah, three goals the scoring and the stoppages on play i'm sure there's a lot more face yeah. offs and whatnot yeah three one flyers how the hell is that happening? Well, the Rangers pretty much have that top seed locked up. Yeah. To be honest with you, if the Rangers feel like they would match up well against the Flyers, uh -huh. it might be to their advantage to let Philadelphia win and get the eighth seed. Well, with how the Metro keeps tripping on their own shoelaces, that could backfire because the Flyers would end up in the third place in the Metro again, if the Penguins, if the Penguins collapse and the Islanders as well. Right. Yeah. Devils tied it, tied it at four a while ago. Apparently do I have a feeling the Dolphins will be better? Uh, no. Six and 11. We should. Well, oh, I'm sure we'll be a uh, nine and eight. Probably lose the division in the last week of the year again. <laughs> I mean, if if the offense is the same way it was last year, whenever we weren't choking, you know, it should be the same feed. Look great against bad teams and then fold against good teams. Right. Markov took a shot. Save by Greaves. Okay. 16.46 to go. Pachara says, Kyle, is it opposite day for Jaws? By saying that pretty much means it's going to be 11 and 6. Well, no, I meant what I said. 
It'd be hilarious though if they actually do go eleven and six. They they have all of the markings of a team that has a chance to take a massive step backwards. I dog says Dolphins will be a wild card exit loss to the Bengals, who will finally win their first Super Bowl this year. Hmm. Anyone but the Chiefs. Yeah, anyone but the Chiefs. Yeah. I mean, I'll let the Jets win with Rodgers over the Chiefs. I don't, I, anybody but the Chiefs. Tom Brady announces he's coming back to the Patriots. Fine. Let him win. I, I don't care. Anybody. And I mean anybody. I think I think John is being John is making a joke. Kulikov. Oh my god, he was so close. What's the joke? John says this just in the NHL is holding an immediate investigation in the Flyers versus Rangers game tonight. They already arrested Torts between the second and third <laughs> periods. Yeah. What's the investigation? Rangers Rangers facilitating the Flyers escaping their own incompetence. Pacharo says Dolphins have a way better defense so far than last season. Um, did you not see all the guys we lost the free agency? Yeah, I, I can't agree with that. Oh, here he comes again, Rodriguez. He tripped over himself. Rangers try not to win the President's Trophy. The crowd's doing, uh, getting into it here a little bit. Oh, they got the wave going. Boy, a lot more people showed yeah. up there. First period, I think, was empty. Yeah. Was there some sort of traffic accident or something? Let's see. Oh. Already at 1344. Yikes. Forsling. It oh. was right in front. Now OEL recovers it and gives it back to Forsling. Stenland is right there in the slot. Just, oh, oh. We kept it in, though. Stenland. Oh, it's still in. Rodriguez scored before you, bro. <laughs> Stenland. You know it's bad when Rodriguez scores <laughs> on his high-quality chance, and you haven't yet. Oh. oh. All right, so I think they finally are going to clear the zone. No, the, the that did not go out. Blue Jackets still haven't cleared the zone, and now they will. Not yet. There they go. Finally, that was like I was just gonna say it was almost like two two minutes in the zone. John says Jaws, who will be assigned to stand up for stand up to Domi in the playoffs versus Toronto. Uh oh, another save by Bubba. Bubba. Bubba, 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 Bubba. Pachara says we have Jordan Poyer and Kendall Fuller in the defense, though. That would have made it a really great defense, what, four or five years ago? Yeah, I mean, we got no pass rush. I mean, don't know if Chubb's going to be ready to start the season. Don't know if Phillips is going to be ready to start the season. You don't know what kind of players they're going to be coming off of those injuries. You lose everybody that we lost. New coordinator. Don't get me wrong. I love the Dolphins. I'll be there screaming and yelling. Yeah. But I, I am prepared for a back step. 
Hey, MJ, thank you for the Ted. Hey, thank you, MJ. Thank you, thank you, thank you, buddy. He says, answers to part two of trivia. Yeah, that was, that was one hell of a question on the second Game one. Game six, 2022-2020-2017-2015-2016-2015-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2017-2
that's probably the only reason why uh, Kachuk is. Uh, Stanley gets high stick, no call. I mean, they're just not going to call. How do they not call that on Kachuk, though? You mean, yeah. You know, I, on the, you know, the Gabranson, how do they not call that at all? Finally past the midway mark of this period. No, this period's gone pretty quick. Now I just want to get off the ice. Do we have anybody on the ice tonight that could fight Gabranson? Hello, Zahir. Well, but what another save? Do I believe they'll score the fourth goal? Um, I think we will. Yeah, we were trying to answer that when they when that whole thing started. Yeah, yeah. I think they'll get. I think it'll be four. I'm not going to say the final because I don't want to jinx anything. Hmm. Why do they? Why do they make commercials like this just to annoy us, Kyle? Hmm. Let's see. Petraro says Jalen Phillips will be back at the start of the season, but Bradley Chubb will still be injured until the middle of the season. Yeah, well, even if they come back, I mean, it takes a while to come back to be in full speed from those injuries. Buffalo has made it 3-1 over Washington. Damn, you're going to choke it up, man. Let me see. What do we got for sports here? So, where's this? Come on. All right. Let's see. Jets are beating the Stars 1 0. Canadians and Islanders are 1 1. Devils and Leafs are 4 4 still. Mm hmm. Sabres three, Capitals one, Lightning two, Senators one, Flyers three, Rangers one, and it's still four three, Penguins over the Red Wings. Red Wings are at eighteen ten, so we there there should be like ten minutes of that game left by the time we're done here. Jameson says the Dolphins will enjoy Jordan Brooks. He has such high potential. Hope so. Hmm. Okay. All right, let's go, guys. Oh, Bubba with another save. All right. 8.44 to go. Who's going to get the fourth one? Want to go Chucky again? Let's ring the bells for Chucky again. <laughs> yeah. Reinhardt has Reinhardt. To... Oh. <laughs> oh, that was a good pass. How do we get it back? Montour is Montour, good. Bad man Montour. <laughs> oh, it hit off the Columbus stick. The Penguins bury a shorthanded goal, 5-3 oh, Pittsburgh. Oh, Alex Lyon, why are you doing <laughs> Penguins can just deadly cup. The bullshit is real. Yeah. So Jeffrey explained that um, our friend, uh, the friends are here, here. He, he's from an island off of Dubai. 
Oh, wow. That's glad, cool. Glad you could join us here. It is so cool, the places that we get people watching us from. Yeah. Jamin says, says, old man Jeff Carter could be the one that sinks Detroit season. Imagine Pittsburgh makes playoffs and Crosby not happy without Gensel. Like I said. Yeah, I mean. <laughs> Sidney Crosby has gotten super sad. Dubas is going to look like a fool if they make the playoffs and then he shouldn't have traded Gensel. Oh, that's okay. a good glove save. Yeah. A lot of shots at that net. There's so many, so many shifts in this game that Columbus. This kid ain't that bad. This goalie's been decent. Yeah. I mean, he's. The two that we got, those weren't on him. I mean, you can only do so much when you, uh, your team is giving up 38 shots on goal. Right. Sends tie it against the Bolts. Oh, boy. I don't think that really impacts the Lightning. Um, no, nah, I mean, if there was any thought that the Lightning were going to take second, but I don't think they care. You mean uh, – Or third, yeah. Can they, there's a lot of ties. Canadians tied with Isles, Lightning tied with Sens, Devils tied with Leafs. A lot of high-scoring games, too. Lightning can still fall. How they're like they're like ten points above the wild card team. No, they can't. Yeah, they could still they could still fall one spot. I don't. I don't, I don't think so. I don't think that's mathematically I, possible. I thought. I thought. I thought that, and somebody corrected me and said they already clinched wild card one. Hmm. Dang it. Rodriguez. Ooh, that goes high. Oh, right there in front. Dang it. Oh, we're going to go on PP. Pee -pee. All right. Is he okay? <laughs> Let's see. Well, at least uh, Gadjevich and Lomborg got some rest tonight. Yeah. And you notice we haven't, you know, when this guy, uh, when Belinskis is on the ice, <laughs> defense is good. I, will, I hope this guy, I hope Bornfoot gets a couple games in, or at least one game in towards the end here. What's that? That's MJ with 20. Hey, thank MJ. You. Thank you, brother. Thank Holy you. crap. Thank you, buddy. Thank you, MJ. He says, totally random, but if we were a football team, Jaws is the head coach, Kyle is the quarterback, <laughs> Trey is the GM, Paul Zambrano is the owner. <laughs> True is the offensive coordinator, and Fluffy is the defensive coordinator. Fluffy's the defensive coordinator. Yeah, I guess because nobody could get around him because he would just whine at him and give him the paw. He can stop anybody with that paw. Doesn't matter what you're doing. If you walk by, Fluffy reaches out that paw. Yeah. You just you're you're immobilized. You must you must bow to the Fluffy paw. <laughs> Yeah, the crowd is pumped, apparently. JC says, I'm the guy scalping tickets. I get off all you guys for free. <laughs> uh. I dog says, I can be the clipboard holder. <laughs> So Panthers on the power play. The question is, though, do we have enough 
good-looking wives and girlfriends to make a cheerleading squad. That's important. Let's see. Come on. There we go. Okay. You know, the good thing about Ocpozo being on the team is there's finally somebody on the team that Chucky can beat in a race. <laughs> oh, oh Barkov. Swing and a miss. Yeah. All right, let's do it. Come on. I want to ring the bell for Chucky. Jeez. Barkov with the shot. This goalie's not bad. He's making some saves. Yeah. It's now 4-1 Flyers. Wow. All right. So it's going to be a wreck after tonight if the Capitals lose. If the if, – if, um, Capitals lose. If the Wings and Penguins both get a point, and then we see who gets the second point. But, no, they got a two-goal lead now, right? Yeah. It's going to be a wreck, like I said. Yeah. I will have by, to make By the it. time people watch your video, half of it will be obsolete. <laughs> yeah. But that's that's the joy of making those videos, right? Yeah. Five seconds left on the power play. I wish we would have done a little bit better there. <laughs> oh no! Whoa, whoa. Oh, and he chooses to keep the play. Yeah, that up. was weird. I guess he wants to get the hell out. He wants to go watch the rest of the Pittsburgh game. Yeah, <laughs> he wants to get to the locker room. No, he just wants to make it as quick as possible for his former team. You know that too. Uh oh, here we go again. Hey, hey, look out for Bob! Who was that who crashed into Jeez. the net? Let's see. Devils on power play. Oh, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Lauren's got him for flinching. <laughs> yeah, I thought whoever that was was going to crash right into Bob. It's a little bit too much physicality for a 3 nothing game at this point, guys. I think it was Kulikov. Yeah. Yeah. And Bob, we. All right. We got lucky there. Five, four devils, Jesper Brett. Jeez, there's no goalies. Okay. All right, guys. There's three minutes left. You know what the thing to do is. Yeah, Kulikov technically scored. Right? Devils three for four on the power play. Wish we had that. Jeez. No, I'll, I'll take uh, I'll take our team with the goaltending. Yeah. Yeah, man. I've watched enough years of excellent offense of, and porous goaltending. Always one goal short because they get that fourth or fifth goal. Yeah. Every once in a while, it's nice to have a high-scoring game because it's exciting, but it gets old when you score four goals and still lose. Yeah! Hey, look at Tarasenko. Tarasenko, all right! Nice. There we go, yeah. There we go. Beautiful, beautiful. Look, There's your fourth goal I right hear. Was that the guy's name? Yeah. Sabres, Sabres 4 1 over the Caps with two minutes left. Wow. Here, just watch this effort here. Forsling sends it over. And then look at this goal. Oh, nice. <laughs> that was backhanded Beautiful. while being turned away from Greaves. <laughs> that takes that takes some skill. Yep. There you go. Yeah, man. Sign that man. Just pay him, please. <laughs> Remember when you were upset because we got him and ruins team chemistry? Well, he did ruin it for Nick Cousins. 
no room for Nick Cousins on the second line because of Tarasenko. <laughs> but I get it. I get it. David, we're going to tune in to Detroit and Pittsburgh at the end of this game. Yeah. It's important business to finish here in the last buck 50, though. Yeah. Hey, MJ, thank you for the two. Hey, thank you, MJ. Thank you, thank you, thank you, buddy. This is thank you, MJ. Goal, Tarasenko, for nothing. <laughs> Beautiful. Sunswine says, I get the feeling Montour and Tarasenko get signed and Reinhardt walks. No, <laughs> no. Tarasenko won't cost much. He took $5 million to play for Ottawa. He'll he'll take half that to play for us. Maybe $3 million. Jacob says. Tell me, you trade Rodriguez and you give Tarasenko his money. It ain't, yeah. it ain't hard. Jacob says, I still remember <laughs> when two games into the season, Choss wanted Eric Stahl back. It, was, it wasn't pretty early in the season, yeah. Yeah. It was it was that Belinskis Mahura pair. Oh, yeah. Mahura, it was it was not pleasant. And as we found out, it was more because of Mahura. <laughs> we got four goals on 44 shots, the wow. Branson. We had 44 shots in this game. Jeez. Yeah. Does Columbus have no defense at all? Hey, Taunts, thank you for the five. Hey, thank you, Taunts. Thank you, buddy. Thank you, Taunts. Thank you, brother. He says, Tarasenko, sweet. Oh, oh. Lorenz oh. went missed wide. You still got the puck. Nerf still was time for the Ocposo hat trick. Nerful with a says Samson off with a point seven two two save percentage. That's who we're playing in round one. God. Flyers up four one on the Rangers. Good lord! Okay. That that playoff race just got a lot tighter now. Yeah. Flyers actually stopped choking. I'm telling you, they saw your video. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. Two, two points. points and two shutouts. All right. Yeah. Yes. More shutouts. Beautiful. Two in a row. We have won 50 games wow. in this season for just the second time in franchise history. Washington got a goal. It's 4-2 Buffalo with a minute left. Say that again? Washington got a goal. It's still 4-2 Buffalo oh, four, with a minute. Okay. Great White says, this must be the fake Bob and that where's the five goals, Bob? <laughs> All right. Hey, back yeah. to back shutouts. Yeah, back to back shutouts. That's awesome. Thank you, MJ. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you brother. Says two points. We won victory. A shutout. Thank you, MJ. That's two in a row, man. Yeah, two shutouts in a row. That that feels good. Of course, it was against the Sens and Blue Jackets. Look at all those rats. The Donna says, "Okay, now play Stolars the rest of the <laughs> yeah." Hey, John, thank you for the two. Thank says, you, John. Thank you, thank you, thank you, buddy. Says back to back shut up pancakes. Yeah, where's the pancakes, Kyle? <laughs> why do I why do we not have pancakes? We're gonna need them. Yeah, for the playoffs. Remember that's I gotta wait another eight days for the pancakes. <laughs> you know what? Watch this. Watch how fast we get pancakes. Next week. Next week, watch this. I'm gonna enjoy this. Erod was next that, week. Right? <laughs> the weather Starting Sunday, 73 and sunny, 74 and sunny, 76 and sunny, 74 it's... and sunny, 78 and sunny, 73 and sunny, 66 and hey. sunny. We need pancakes because we got to yeah. mow that damn yard. Oh, hey, on a Dylan Larkin just scored is now 5 4. 5 4 with 653 left. Hey, Taunts, thank you for the two. Thank you, Taunts. Thank you, brother. Thank you, Taunts. For the thank you, Taunts. So we just switched over to uh, – Yeah, we switched over to change, – change the banner so they know if somebody new comes. 
I'll watch this the rest of the way until, and I'll do the recap Let's after see. the game. You know, rush. Right? There's no rush. Not There's tonight. <laughs> that was a quick game, too. It's 9.30. It's <laughs> not even 9.30. It's 9.28. Yeah, we'll watch this game now. I mean, we, they got enough time for four more goals with this goaltending. Detroit has four goals on 26 shots, and Pittsburgh has five goals on 22 shots. Jeez. And we're riding two straight shutouts. <laughs> I mean, I know it's Ottawa and Columbus. The Devils have five goals on 18 shots. Oh, my God. <laughs> Jeez. Can the playoffs start tomorrow? MJ, thank you for the two. Thank you, MJ. Thank you, buddy. Thank you, MJ. He says, everyone hit the like button and subscribe. Yeah, much appreciated. Five and a half minutes to go in the third of the Detroit and Pittsburgh game. Yeah, that's one thing we got to start practicing during the stream is asking for likes because that is when, yeah. when people like the stream as it goes on in the game, YouTube will show it to more and more people because of the likes. <laughs> No, that's that's yeah, that's that's reels. So we gotta we gotta try to remember to start asking. You know, I'm not good at any of that stuff. Nerful says he should watch the end of the Leafs game. If Devils hold on, it practically guarantees practically guarantees that uh the uh, Panthers have home ice. There's six ten left in this one, and there's yeah Christian five thirteen left in Devils Leafs. Christian, um, we did hear that OJ Simpson died. Yeah, we just need one point. If the Leafs lose tonight, we just need one point to clinch second place. So you play Stolars against Buffalo on Saturday. Yeah. You get your two points, and then you just – I don't care what you have to do. I don't want to see Bob, Chucky, Barkoff. Reinhardt, I don't want to see those guys on the ice at all <laughs> against the Leafs. Yeah, Buffalo held on and beat Washington 4-2. Wow. That yeah, the standings are going to be crazy. The game ended so quickly that we switched over to Detroit and Pittsburgh, and it's – just now, nine thirty-one. Yeah, that's what I mean. I mean, that was that was exactly what the doctor ordered there with 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 that quick third period. Fifty-eight says that game felt like it would have been seven nothing if Erod scored on more of his chances. Senators and Lightning are tied to. All right, let's go, guys. Okay. Who are we rooting for, by the way? Uh, rooting for, I guess we want chaos, so root for Pittsburgh. Yeah. Yeah. New Jersey 5, Toronto 5. So that means Toronto oh just tied God. it. Good Lord. That would, even if they, if they get one point, if we get two points against Buffalo, we'll have it clinched. Oh, oh my, my God. God! Another goal. The, Detroit just tied it. Detroit has tied it at five. Oh my God! Jeez. <laughs> Is that guy Raymond again? Yeah. Do any of these teams have any defense? <laughs> All right, here we go. Uh, who got caught? Who's that? Was that Crosby coming back not back fast enough? Yeah, that I think that's Crosby. I think that was Crosby, wasn't it? Here's the angle. Yeah, that was Crosby. E yep. Dang. There could be two overtime games. Two five five games with heavy in playoff implications. Best time of the year. <laughs> that is says crazy. George. Yeah, it's goaltending optional night in yeah, the Yeah, right? Yeah. Oh. 
Here it's, they come again. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, now he made a save. This is like run and gun. Ain't nobody playing defense. This is what the play. This is what playoff hockey is like. If you're not watching the Panthers, yeah, <laughs> right. It's to a different style of game. Oh yeah, I have to change the banner score. Oh yeah, I forgot that I had even changed the banner over. The Red Wings apparently, a commercial again? apparently scored two goals in less than two Find the Find uh, the other game. So while we're on commercial, we can flip back and forth. Sunswine says this was us last year clawing and scratching our way in. I don't – I would have to actually go looking for – I see. We could be better to just stick here. Canadians up 2 1 on the Islanders. Wow. wow. Dennis says, Come on, Devils, get your act together. Okay. All right. Yeah, Grandpa loved the video. I, I sent it to him. Yeah. He, he loved the video. That's and awesome. Him and, uh, him and Grandma watched it. That's awesome. Yeah. Jamison says, this Penn's run reminds me of our run last year as well. A little bit. A little bit. They are, I mean, the fact, I mean, when they traded Gensel, they lost like, what, two it was like two games in a row. They lost like five nothing or something like that. I mean, it was it was bad. You okay, buddy? Can you get up? Oh, he just moved, huh? I see what he does now. That is that comfortable with that leg like that? The leg is like all the way out. <laughs> Lola says, "Let's go, Pen." All right. So what do we got, Kyle? Let's see. Let's see. Oh, there's, they got Ben Sherratt. No wonder they can't play defense. Come on, show the time. All right, 407 left. So with the Canadians currently beating the Islanders, this isn't just a fight for wild card spot. The Penguins could go into, I think, third place in the Metro. Yeah, I mean, the standings are going to be an absolute shit show. <laughs> so what? Oh, who did you say is winning? The Canadians, Canadians are beating the – oh, it's 2-1. Yeah. yeah, they got a lot of time left in that game. That's a – that's a lot of team people losing tonight. Well, if the Flyers won – and then if the Penguins win. The Devils just scored. So that must mean oh it's now 6-5. Who's in net for Toronto? That's Samsonov. Oh, they've left him in the whole time? I don't know, actually. Hey, MJ, thank you for the 10. Hey, thank you, MJ. Thank you, buddy. Thank you, thank you, thank you, MJ. Says... Jaws and Co. I just remembered I saw a video you did where Jaws played a guy from Puerto Rico interviewing for the Panthers head coaching job, and Kyle was the GM was the Panthers. It was hilarious. Yeah, I appreciate that, MJ. We used to do a lot of skits and stuff the first couple years, and then life got hectic. <sighs> It was it was it was tough a lot of times trying to do skits when you know when Matthias was around and my daughter was still there. We had the three active dogs. It it got, it'd get hectic, real hectic. But I've been telling Kyle for no no lie, I've been telling him for years that he needs to do stuff that he's really good on camera. And it, it, he he finally took my advice. Oh, so that's good because then I keep I can retire soon. 
I'm too old for YouTube, Todd. That's why the channel don't grow. <laughs> they need young blood like you. The aisles have tied it. Are you kidding me? Jeez. Like every minute somebody is scoring a goal. Devils have six goals on 20 shots. All right, so we got a buck 45 left here and until Matthias. Hey, Great White, thank you for the five. Hey, thank you, Great White. Thank you, buddy. Says thank you, Great White. Rhino number 54. Yeah. Yeah. So is this game going to overtime first or is Devils Devils six, Maple Leafs five with a buck 14 left? Come on, hold that one, Jersey. Make our life a little easier. Yeah, the Leafs, Leafs power play six on four with 42 seconds left to oh go. Oh, my God, of course. Because they have beat the Nets. Jeez. Here we come. The wings. Dumped it in. All right. Is that going to be hey, icing? Jackson, icing. thank you for the two. Hey, thank you, Jackson. Thank you, buddy. Much appreciated. It says back to back shutouts. Yep. Derek says, Flyers won. I don't know what to do with my hands. Right. <laughs> Devils Maple Leafs got 43 seconds left. These two games are going to end right at about the same exact time. Just this one probably going to overtime. Oh, oh, here oh. comes Pittsburgh. Oh, that was uh, that was a save. 41 seconds left. Pittsburgh still controls. A big rebound by Lyon. Pittsburgh, ah, it's out of the zone. 28 the seconds left. Devils won, apparently. Devils won, regulation. <sighs> Christian says, I guess all these teams saw your video. Right? Fifth, ten seconds left. Pittsburgh has possession of the puck. Oh, it's loose in front. Devil shot. Oh, Delkovich made the save. And, and we are going, going to overtime. overtime. Of course. All right, so the Devils won. That's good. The Capitals lost. Canadians and Islanders, that's going to be a while. So I'll watch overtime, and then I'll go do the recap. Okay. Yeah. Everybody gets a point. Oh, my God. Flyers finally win a game. They look up. Everybody gets a point. It's like, God damn it. Overtime in Tampa as well, apparently. Yeah, I see that. Jeez. I'm surprised that Toronto lost to the Devils. I thought they would have been playing a tougher game trying to get second place. But maybe not. I guess they're not interested. Yeah, the Panthers are now up five points over Toronto. Yeah, we just we need one point to clinch. So if we beat Buffalo, then we can we could just sit everybody against Toronto. The game don't matter. None of it matters because we're not even in a we're not even in a situation to be thinking about Carolina. That's done too. Wait a minute, it's not done. We Carolina has 107 points. We have 106 points, but Carolina has a game in hand. Well, that would matter. I don't think we'd want to play hard against the Leafs to do it, but it, it would, it, it could matter later in the, in the, you know, if we made it to the finals, Kenneth, Eastern Conference Finals. Kenneth says the Panthers are one point back of the Boston. Yeah, let's see how long that lasts. Right. 
Oh, I don't want first place, man. When does Boston play? They got an extra game too. Good. Carolina play Saturday plays. against the Penguins. Who? Saturday night Bruins Penguins, Kyle. Oh my God! You want to you want to do it? Uh... Panther game starts at five. We could just dump those people into that stream. Mm. Then Monday is Bruins Capitals, and then they end the season Bruins Senators. It's a thought. It's a thought. All right, who are we rooting for? Detroit or Pittsburgh? Oh, that's right, Pittsburgh. Right? We're rooting for for chaos. Yeah. And no shootout. No shootout, please. I don't want to see Alex Lyon get abused like that. Crosby right now is like probably would probably like it would be nice to have Gensel on the ice right about now. Yeah. Let's see. Pittsburgh is apparently five and twelve in the overtime this year. Mm. All right, Pittsburgh has possession first. Being kept to the outside, and now they just come right out of the zone. Christian is rooting for the Red Wings. <laughs> All right, Pittsburgh still with possession. Not doing anything. We're just keeping it to the outside. I mean, I guess you can't lose if the puck's on your stick. Now they lose it. And now Detroit's got it, and they've got something going here. It's a two-on-one. Two on one. One. There we go. Oh, oh, save. It's it's loose, but they blew the whistle. Looked like he had it covered up, and then they, it was loose, but he, he blew the whistle. Maybe he was trying to move it along. How many points behind Toronto does Tampa have? Uh, Toronto and Tampa? Yeah. Um. Uh, Tampa is still six points behind. So that's that's not happening. Three fifty six left. Face off in the Pittsburgh zone. Yeah. All right, Pittsburgh wins the draw. <laughs> Collectively, here's 10 goals on 55 shots. <laughs> that is not good. For the goalies. Exactly. <laughs> oh, oh. oh. That was very Yeah, that cool. was very close. Oh, bad giveaway. Goal. Oh. End of the game. Penguins Jeez. win. Penguins win. I think that was Carlson. That was Carlson. <laughs> well. They just, somebody, I got to see the replay. Bad giveaway right into the slot. And Lion had no chance. Carlson just was able to just step into it and just absolutely obliterate the shot. <laughs> So Pittsburgh gets the extra point, and that is just beautiful. It's gonna, it's gonna be so chaotic. <laughs> We're gonna wake up with one game left, and everybody's got like eighty-seven points. Like five teams are gonna be tied <laughs> with eighty-seven points. Yeah. All right, uh, we get the celebration. Show the highlight. Come on, they didn't win the cup or anything, guys. Just Den Dennis says, "Poor lion." <laughs> Yeah, Lion got hung out the dry on that one. <laughs> Show no. the highlight. They're still showing these guys. Sell I mean, it's the Pittsburgh home broadcast, so I get it. Red Wings are not out, but right, this does hurt them. 
Here we go. All right. So the puck lion gets it to the back end. Oh, I see. That's kind of on lion a little bit because he didn't he didn't knock it away fast enough from the side of the net. And I mean that that's, that's I, I love Alex Lyon, but Alex Lyon is um that not, is apparently Crosby's one thousand career assist. Jeez, man. So Pittsburgh gets it. All right. They're celebrating like it is their ticket to the cup. Yeah, I know. Well, you know, hey, we were celebrating like that last year too when we were trying to get in. Yeah. Right? Yeah. All right, everybody. Kyle's Gotcha. I'm gonna go do finally do the recap. If I can okay. remember to score the, the game, we got that fourth goal, right? Yeah, it was four nothing. Okay. Thank you all for watching, Kyle. We'll see you, and then I'll come back after the recap. I'll be live tomorrow at noon. Kyle might be helping me tomorrow at noon, and uh, I'll have a podcast out tomorrow as well for the members and everything. And uh, appreciate all the super chats. Much, much, much great appreciation. Yeah. Got it. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Let's see. Oh. ESPN is not updated yet for the the games. Let's see. Tampa Bay and Ottawa are still tied with halfway through that overtime. Well, congrats to the Penguins. That has made it much more likely that the uh, Penguins are going to possibly get a playoff spot. Yeah. This is pretty this is pretty fun. Let's see. Yeah, yeah, Jaws is doing the recap. The Canadians and Islanders are still tied at two, huh? Jameson says this sends bolts overtime is fun to watch. Fluffy is behind the couch. So this this was pretty this was a pretty fun night. The the Pan, Panthers win four nothing against Columbus, and we get to watch the ending of the Penguins and Red Wings game. The Penguins beat the Red Wings in overtime six to five. Right now, that means as of this moment, the Penguins the Penguins are in the second wild card spot. Let's see. Give me one second. I want to see if I can watch the Tampa Bay and Ottawa game. Jets 2 stars nothing. Yeah, here it is with just three and a half seconds left. In overtime, Tampa is going to have a three and a half second power play. Three 
Fluffy, I'm sure, is happy. And ladies and gentlemen, the Ottawa and Tampa game is going to the shootout. What do I think the Panthers will do in their last two games of the season? I don't know. Um, three points, maybe? I think we'll win against Buffalo. I don't know if we're going to beat Toronto in that last regular season game. Is Tampa still going to play Boston in round one as of this moment? Yeah. This is the first career shootout for Matt Tompkins. Matt Tompkins is apparently the goalie in for for the uh, Lightning. And that's Anton Forsberg for the Sens. Let's see. Let's see. Both the Sens and Lightning apparently are 3-0 and in the shootout this year. So one of these teams is going to lose their first shootout game of the season tonight. Oilers get to finish the season with five games in seven nights. Some schedule makers don't like them. Let's see. Tampa, Tampa did not score on the first sh shot in the shootout. Now, now it's Brady Kachuk, and Brady is Brady Kachuk scores for the Sens. So. So it's round, here's round two of the shootout. Tampa is down one. And, and that's another save for Forsberg. Let's see. Yeah, that was Braden points getting uh, stonewalled by by Forsberg, and now here's Claude Giroux. <laughs> and that is no goal. So Tampa is Tampa has to score. Tampa has to score against Forsberg, or else Ottawa will win the game. See. And Ottawa has just beaten Tampa in the shootout. So Ottawa takes the 3 2 victory in the shootout. Interesting. Very interesting. That last Lightning player uh, hit the crossbar. David says, why the F were they playing Tompkins this game? So that uh, Vazzy can rest, I guess? Yeah, Tampa Bay is five points back of the Leafs. 
with three games to go, which means all the Leafs have to do is get an extra point, and the Leafs are guaranteed no worse than third. No worse than third in the Atlantic. How is that uh, Montreal and Islanders game going, by the way? Ottawa just beats the Lightning in the shootout. In the shootout? Yeah. Well, oh. apparently they weren't starting Bazzi, the Lightning. They were starting oh. Matt Tompkins. Oh, geez. That's not even Jonas Johansson. <laughs> All right, then. Okay. Get a drink of water and we'll get this we'll get this party started. Yeah. It's been a long day. Good day. But it's definitely been a long day. Ugh. Yeah. The light Papa John's offers half off a pizza the day after a lightning win. Habs Isles, that game is tied at two. The Isles Habs game is tied at two with less than a minute to go. Was it not on TV? I actually let me go find it. Oh, yeah. it's right here. There you go. You just watch that and then we'll click off. Okay. See, this is why we pay the money. Yeah. <laughs> all right, we'll it's unmute it. To get all the games. Oh, I want the Islanders to win just for the chaos. No, that's not enough chaos. If the Isles lose... Oof. If the Isles lose what? The Penguins could overtake them for third in the Metro. Well, they're already going to get a point. Let me see. Eight seconds left. Kick to four. Oh, oh, oh! oh. Oh, that would have been great. And we are going to overtime again. Again. So let's see. Oh, I don't want that. Um, so many games going to overtime. So the Wings got 85 points. The Islanders have 87. Penguins have 86. I don't know if that 87 counts the point they just got. Probably not. I don't think it can update that fast. Yeah. Capitals, 85. Flyers, 85. But, yeah, the Islanders are in good shape now with that point for third place in the Metro. Do the Penguins and Islanders play? Is that the – no, the Penguins do not play the Islanders. Yeah, Penguins Islanders' this last game of the year. Oh my god! Oh yeah, and it's it's Wednesday the seventeenth. Oh, and we don't play. The Panthers have, last game was on the sixteenth. Oh. So if, if that game has if that game has implications, we're definitely streaming that game. But first, the Penguins got to play the Bruins and the Predators. <laughs> <laughs> Who the Bruins and the Predators? That's the Penguins' next two games. The... <laughs> yeah, so if they survive that. So, yeah, I definitely want the Isles to win here. Well, no, if I want it to be closer, I want them to lose. Right? Sunswine says, just watch the Kyle video. That was so funny. Great stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we want the Islanders to lose here, right? Because that's more chaos. Yeah. Dylan says, I wanted Detroit to win because of line, but it was a fantastic night for the Panthers with the regulation loss and Panthers regulation win. <laughs> yeah, no, it's been, it's been. All right, so let so we're rooting for Montreal. If the Isles, if the Isles lose this game, that will be their 16th overtime loss. God, I see that. Yeah. Wow. All right, and that's Montebo. So we'll root for Montreal here. Montebo, and that's uh, Varlamov for the Isles. Yeah. 
Yeah, IDK, yeah. we're still streaming. We yeah, want to. Yeah, we're gonna. Yeah, we're gonna finish the. Uh, it's Islanders in mind and Canadians in overtime. Then we're gonna go. But yeah, if if the Islanders lose, it's it's better, more chaos. Yeah. Oh, oh, it almost happened. Oh, it almost immediately happened. And now the Isles player is going the other way. Hey, hello, Matheson. Oh, Caulfield was trying to pull heroics over there. Boy, that, that two points Pittsburgh guy really hurts the Flyers, though. Yeah. I'm sure it does. Cause, cause but the got... Flyers won. I think. Yeah, but they Flyers only have two games left. Pittsburgh has three, <sighs> and, and that's going to be tough. Kenneth says it's NHL red zone on Flying Fluffy tonight. Yeah, <laughs> and then the Capitals are still alive. Oh no! Oh, oh, oh. They went high. You were saying saying the Capitals are still alive. Yeah. Oh, jeez, what wow. a shot. Wow, can't even be mad. Can't even be mad about that. Wow. Wow. Dang. That was quick, too. All right, so that, that definitely, um, what, what I need to know now what we need to know now, yeah, and I bet you it's Pittsburgh, is who has the, the se second wild card. No, the um, tiebreaker between Pittsburgh and, and the Islanders, because let's because if if the it, Islanders are now two points ahead, and that last game, if if they finish tied, yeah, then then who uh, I I wins confident it's the Penguins. The Penguins have that. Tiebreaker. The Penguins have 12 overtime losses too. But the Isles have had 16. It's regulation wins. That's what I mean. So the Islanders have 36 wins. The Penguins have 37 wins. So it depends on how many games they won in overtime. Yeah, this wild I think that's going to give the Islanders 37, but it's not regulation. This wild card race is incredible. Yeah. That's crazy. I know these standings can't be updated because the Islanders still stuck at 87 points. Look at. I mean, what a shot, though. Kicks it forward. And then they just kind of left them. And then, jeez. Wow. Russ says, awesome win for the Pens. Yep. And the Red Wings are like, oh, come on. Yeah. <laughs> right? Yeah. Yeah, so the Flyers, even though they won, they're still choking dead a little bit there. Kenneth says, Pittsburgh 31 regulation wins. New York Islanders 27. So, so it's Pittsburgh. Yeah, Pittsburgh. So it's so... If that last game of the year could definitely be yeah. for that playoff spot because all they got to do is stay even. And even if the Penguins are two points out, yeah, if they win a regulation, they'd get it. No, but that's the third and fourth spot. Yeah, this this race, Jameson put it right. This race for the last wild card spot in the East has been so weird. I did an entire video about it. That's how weird. It's been. What about between the Capitals? How many regulation overtime? How many regulation wins do the Capitals have? Mute that, Kyle. Because we they could still end up. Oh my, this is crazy. <laughs> you can't figure it out. It's too much to figure out. All right, you ready? I got yeah, I'm video. ready. You're done. You've had a long day, too. Okay. okay, everybody. I think that's it. I think there's no more hockey. Yeah, <laughs> we'll do that during the playoffs, though. Wait till yeah. wait till Kyle finds out that after the uh Washington 29 regulation wins. Thanks. Wait till Kyle mm -hmm. finds out during the playoffs after the after the Panther games 
that we're just gonna stream go right into the West Coast game. What? Huh? You want to be homeless or you want to have food? You tired of eating peanut butter and jelly? Huh? We could get a whole new West Coast fan base. <laughs> he thinks I'm kidding. He thinks I'm kidding. Jeez. All right, everybody. Thank you all again. And all right. I'll see you tomorrow at noon. Good night, everyone. I will see you tomorrow at noon. Uh, nice try. I <laughs> will see you tomorrow at 1230. He can do the second half. Okay, fine. All right. Good night, everybody. Good night. <laughs>